Welcome to Zero Page Classic, uh, <laughs> <laughs> your sure. best source for the newest and, and oldest old. Atari right. games. Uh, we're doing something very different today. Yes. We're not playing homebrew, <laughs> <laughs> so we're betraying the name of the show. Um, we're doing this because this year is the 45th anniversary of the release of the Atari 2600. Mm -hmm. And that's what we started with on this show, is doing 2600 games, and then we expanded into the full Atari line, except for the ST. Mm. Um, so, to celebrate the 45th anniversary of the Atari 2600, we are going to play every single Atari 2600 game that was released during the run of the console. And that spans from 1977 September 11th, when it was released, yeah. all the way to 1992 was the wow. last... The last cart that came The out. last cart and the wow. last year wow. that the 2600s were on the store shelves wow. for sale. Okay. So, it's a lot. <laughs> yeah, 45 <laughs> years. That makes me old as dirt. Yes. All of us. All of us. We're all, all old us. as dirt. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen the demographics of this show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're all old as dirt. Um... So before we get into that, I want to thank all the wonderful subscribers who help support the show and help watch, or just watch the show. You don't need to help watch. You can just watch it. Mm -hmm. And they're scrolling down the side beside Tanya. Plus a few new people. Yes. Yeah. And I'll shout those out at the end. Yeah. Uh, they are Alna for Arms Car Coder, Atari 800XL Rules, Atari 1974, Atari Age, Atari's Maximus, Beer Poke, Buck Owens, Burl Ives, Cat Zero, Chalsa Donny Mao, Charles and Chuck, Charles Winch, Cyrano Boo, Dino, Daniel, Daryl, 1970, Dr. Moose, Cows. Fox Mulder, Great Defender, Ground Trooper, Roger, Rapper, Johnny W.C. Carl G., Ken Jennings, Invader, Kev Kelly, Croco, Lauren T.D. Zad, Marty Kuhl, Johannes, Mark Spacing, Metal Atari, McMuse, Mike Soul, Mike Littell, Miss Command, M.K. Smith, Mr. Fix, Muddy Stunt, Funster, and Nathan Strump, Nostalgic Packer, VG Koag, R.N. Schwitz, R.C. 70, Randy Ghost, Repentless P. V.G., Ricardo Pim, Rodcaster, Six Weeks, Made to Be Spice, Where S. Ramirez, The D Train, Lost Cartridge, Welsh Man, TGD, K, TM Events, TM Events, Trek MD, X, Ken X. It's a lot. Ooh. And Excellent. just before the show, Colonel Lama subscribed, Packrat VG resubscribe, and Kabuto JRM subscribe <laughs> for uh, uh, the first time, uh, and Colonel Lama for the first time as well. Wonderful. So thank you thank so you. much for supporting the show. Yeah. Uh, old as dirt. I think I predate dirt. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Danny says, 1977, I was 11. I got the 2600 for Christmas. Mm. Wow, you got it early. That's awesome. What games did you get with it? Was it just the pack? -ins. Pa just the pack, and of course, you yeah. got combat. Mm. But did you get any other cartridges as well, like an extra we'll, one or two? Maybe we'll be playing them today. Uh, well, we will. Hopefully. <laughs> That's for yeah. sure. If you got it in 1977, <laughs> we'll be playing it. Because we'll be playing tonight, 1977 through 1979, first three years yeah. of the Atari 2600 releases. And how many games? Uh, you have your list there. Uh, oh, you didn't add them up. <laughs> uh, I don't have numbers here. Yeah, it's a lot. Uh, no, it's not too many. It's like 27, 27. 20, no, or 25, I don't know. Something like that. I'll have to load up the, <laughs> the spreadsheet. Um, so the first one is Combat, which is the pack-in cartridge. Yes. And the last one released was, where is my notes, Acid Drop in 1992, and that was a PAL-only release. Okay, okay. Um, so it, the Atari went for 15 years, was on the store shelves. For 15 which years. Which is pretty long time. It's that right, is. It's right up there with, with uh, the longest-running consoles. Like, uh, I know the Genesis one for a very long time, Sega yeah. Master System for a very long time. Mm -hmm. There are ones that ran for older, mm -hmm. for longer, but uh, not too many because they want to put out the next one. Mm -hmm. I think modern consoles go for about seven years, seven, eight, maybe yeah. around there till they release the next one. Yeah, but yeah. releasing the next one doesn't mean you still can't get games for the older consoles. Yes, and I think but they usually do discontinue them or put out yeah like the the developers want to reach the biggest market possible yeah. and they want to make it for the newest so they can show off their graphics but right? i feel like in the 70s 80s 90s the technology was changing so dramatically there's yes. more motivation to switch up whereas now you it's can, a little bit you can you can hold on to your system for quite a while and still be very yeah know, they usually release them for two much. 
at the same time. Yes. The two yeah. con two generations. Yeah. Because like they'll they'll release right now for PS4 and PS5. Which we have a PS4 and not a PS5, and yeah. you still find games, right? Yeah, still so, find games yeah. for I mean I have the Switch, so we yeah. have the newest one for that, but we still buy games for the PS4. Yep. Yeah. Because we switched over to PC because yeah. they're just computers in a box now. It's true. They are nothing special. All the controllers look the same, except for Nintendo, and that's why we keep buying the Nintendo mm -hmm. ones. We'll see what's next for yeah. that. Yeah. Um so how this is going to work. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um because there are I haven't added them all up yet, the ones we're going to go through. Yeah. And we'll be playing all of them, all the ones that actually got a release on cartridge, and we'll be playing PAL exclusives as well. Mm. We won't be playing prototypes because those weren't released during the run. They were discovered after and then put on card or whatever was done with them, put out in binary. Um, so there's about mm, 450 games. So that's a lot of games, mm -hmm. right? So we can't explore them fully obviously we can't go through all the variations we can't win them all no. we would be here longer than the year and we'd be going into the 46th anniversary of the 2600 yeah and we're also not a show that does classic games either we not concentrate that. on no. homebrew yeah we'll talk, we'll play hacks from time to time and you know remakes and things like that but yeah. n most like 99.9 .9 .9 homebrew yeah. right um so we're doing this in After Dark, not our regular series. We're doing it in After Dark, so it doesn't disrupt us playing the new games that are coming out. Mm -hmm. No. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Little key. So we had to figure out a way how to get through them. And a first time chatter from uh, Legend of Sla. Uh, we had to limit it so we could get through them. So I figured about five minutes each. Yeah. It's enough to kind of explore it a tiny bit. You get an idea of what it's about. You get a feel for the game. Watch us fail completely oh on it. <laughs> Go, oh my God, the yes. controls are crazy. We've yeah. never played this before. Mm -hmm. um, we are not experts at... Eh, oh, some of these games we're pretty good at, but we're not experts. At, we're not no. professing to be experts at them. We're not going to give a history lesson of each of the games. We don't have time for that. <laughs> we're just going to have fun yeah. and play through all the games. And by the end, we'll be able to say we have played, played every, single, every game. single Atari 2600 game. Yeah. And we're just going to go through them, but we are going to do them in order of release. Yep. The actual, as best as we can find, order of release. Mm -hmm. um, and the release dates that I are i'm getting f these from like i was looking them up and trying to find release dates it's pretty sketchy because nobody was really keeping track back then mm. of oh this came out exactly this date and yeah. there was no big launches where people stood in lineups and kind of things like that um and anticipation so records are sketchy yeah um so i got a lot of the information um from wikipedia which was not great it's Full of errors. Mm. Um, uh, Thomas Yench's um, Clone Spy spreadsheet, which is very good for variations okay. of the games, because he compares all the ROM dumps, okay. binary dumps of all the variations. Of different games. And it's very well labeled. Okay. Um, but mostly the Random Terrains website, where he or somebody collected newspaper clippings. Oh, wow. From back in the 70s and 80s and found like compared them and looked because you can see the date of yeah. the newspaper yeah. and the advertisements in the newspaper and what was the earliest advertisement for this game mm -hmm. or mention of a release date or something like that so that's really what we're going off of and i think that's the most accurate mm -hmm. and this is a super well-researched website mm -hmm. it, it lists multiple dates and i went with the earliest listed release of it mm -hmm. because some were advertising oh it's coming out soon so there's going to be a bit of variation. There's going to be like, oh, no, that came out later. Or that came out earlier. But this is what give I'm going take. off of. Because give or take. Give or take. Yeah. So this is the most accurate that I can find on the web. And mm -hmm. it's pretty It's pretty good. Um, so the Atari 2600 was introduced in 1977. September 11th was is kind of the accepted date. Okay. Um, it was advertised in like the Sears Wish Book in before that, a couple months before. Yeah. Um, for the Christmas holidays. So they had listings for them and the games. Um, like, whenever that came out. July, August, you know. But the f earliest mm. in-store for sale date is September 11th. Okay. 
Um, and we're going to be playing these games. Today is the first day we're going to be playing them. And the last day we're going to be playing the games is on September 11th. Okay. And we'll be wrapping it up on that day. So the very last few games we'll be playing on that day. On the anniversary. That's the exciting. exact okay. 45th anniversary. So got to cram a lot in between now and then. <laughs> Whoa, we've only got uh, seven weeks. <laughs> and, just, and a small vacation in there somewhere. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we'll be off for a week and a half yeah. during that. So it'll yeah. be fast and furious. Uh, but we're doing this in After Dark. So mm. we'll be doing it whenever we can mm -hmm. cramming in two to three times a week so hopefully you'll stick with us yeah and <laughs> yeah. you know play along with us too yeah. or or share your memories of yeah. each of these games which are your favorite stuff like that Look when up. when we when we start with something and it suddenly it evokes some nostalgia <laughs> that yeah. long forgotten memory of playing a certain game with a certain friend in a certain yeah. basement in someone's house <laughs> exactly and i'll be reminiscing too of the yeah. games um, like Dave M says, I got mine in 1980 with Combat, Space Invaders, nice. Video Pinball, Circus Atari, and Championship Soccer. Nice. And Space Invaders was the killer app for the Atari VCS. Okay. And that's the one that um, really launched it, that took it into the stratosphere mm -hmm. in 1980. Before that, it was, you know, not too many people had it. Yeah. But then they're like, oh my God, I can play Space Invaders at home? And that was a fairly new game it's, in, it's in 1980. So yeah. Um, and that that was a the thing they were bringing home the arcade experience. Well, yeah, at that exactly. Point. That was I, you can you can totally see how that marketing worked. Yeah, work, it's like I know? don't have to pay quarters anymore. Yeah, exactly. Yay. Well, yeah. I better play a lot of these. Or all the parents were like, "Yeah, I don't have to, you know, <laughs> give my kid a pockets full of quarters and yeah, yeah. spending all their allowance on it." So it's like, <laughs> yeah. nope, it's just that stay at home. Um, it was introduced for about one hundred and seventy to one hundred and eighty dollars mm -hmm. in September nineteen seventy seven. Which was, that was a lot of around nine hundred to a thousand dollars in today's money. What? Yeah, it was a wow. lot of money. Wow, I figured money. it would be it would be quite a <laughs> inflationary markup. Like, but yeah. I didn't realize it was based that on much. whatever the the inflation wow. calculators. That, yeah, inflation calculators. It's give or it's, take. It's give Who or knows? take. But yeah. it's up there. It's huge. Yeah. It's a wow. lot of money. Wow. Um, and the cartridges sold for twenty bucks. Okay. So multiply by five, so about a hundred dollars. Mm. So they were not cheap. They were actually more expensive back then than they are now. And that's actually so true. So anybody complaining about prices now? Yeah, you don't. buy you buy a big RPG or Steam game 60, for 60, 70, 60, 70 80 dollars Canadian. Well, apparently yeah. the cartridge. This is American dollars. For more. Yeah, that's true. So Canadians, that's even more shocking. Even more. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And um, the Indy 500, which came with driving controllers, mm. which was the first external peripheral, uh, sold for $34.95. Okay. Um, because joysticks came with the system. Okay. And paddles came with the system. Yes. So the first external one was the Indy um, 500 with the driving controllers. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Um, so the first game for the system would be Combat. Mm. It's this one and um, that was pa a pack-in game and uh, it is only t a two-player game <laughs> so a lot of these early games have no AI no you have it's just you and you uh, and the other friend. person had to play it yeah but I I consider those some yeah. of the most fun is you're playing against a yeah. human it's it's totally unexpected what they're going to do yeah like a computer, you can game well, a computer and you can learn their weaknesses. True. But it takes a little bit to learn the other person's weakness and then they improve because like, oh no, they found out my weakness. I have to change my tactics, right? Yeah. But it also made video gaming more of a non, I don't know, uh, more of a group's game, you know? Yes. And you would You would invite your friends over to play it with you. Yeah, group activity. Yeah. I mean, now you have the internet, you play with people on the internet, but just back in the day, you know, you drag your friends over and you play video oh, games. Oh, yeah. It was awesome. So I do have most of... Hold on. I can't pick them all up. Um, but most of the games we're going to be playing today yeah. on cartridge... Um, Certainly we'll, have a nice chunk of them. Yeah, I'd say 75%. We are hoping when they get shoved in, they, they, they work. will work. <laughs> We do have our isopropanol and Q-tips nearby, just in case. So if you'd like to clean off the uh, combat cartridge, <laughs> this is the most important one okay. that work to work, right? All right. Oh. And I believe this is um, the original release. It looks like, oh, maybe not, but it looks like, can anybody verify if this one is, that's very dark, isn't it? The original look 
to uh, the cartridges. There we go. I don't think it is. I don't. But it does look like it. Mm. it looks very old school. Um, so you have to open that up. Let me do that. Oh my goodness. So you have to. Looks like original cards to me, says Lord Monkus. Excellent. So don't let that up. Hold it in. Oh. There you go. I'm just. That's what my copy looks like, Lord Monks says. Excellent. Yeah, so playing the original one that was presumably a pack-in that came with a system. Um, I do not have a heavy sixer, <laughs> which is the original system that was made in uh, California. Ooh, dirty. Um, oh, probably. And um, But I do have a light sixer. I'm still looking for a heavy sixer. It would be nice to find. Um, I did see one at PRG one year. I didn't open it up to take a look at the how the condition of it. I was about to pull the trigger. It was 200 US. And then I wandered away and wandered back and it was gone. So oh, sadness. I should have bought it if it was good inside. There you go. Oh, that's filthy. Didn't the oldest one have zero one one combat in the end label? Oh, it might have. I do have a zero one one combat. Um, somebody might have to. Oh, the originals had a end label. Do I have any numbered ones? Oh, I don't in this set. I know I do have some, because I have doubles of some of the original ones. Okay. Pretty clean? Eh, yeah, clean enough. Clean enough? Well, we shall see. We will, we'll see about that. Um, okay. Uh, so, we're going to give five minutes mm -hmm. for each game. Some of these games I'm very familiar with. Some of these games I'm not so familiar with, especially the ones with the keyboard controls. Oh, okay. So I do have instructions on standby. We might be muddling our way through the keyboard ones. Okay, fair enough. Um, because they're like, they have overlays and mm -hmm. they're somewhat complicated. I thought basic programming was 1979. It's but not. on further inspection, it's 1980, so that'll be next time. Okay, good. So I will pre-prepare myself for that one. Because we're going to type in a... Um, a lot of these on hand. We're going to type in a, a very, very simple program for that one. So okay. that we can actually run a program. I'm going to use the uh, Tanya's Galaga t-shirt. represents a game that is more recent than you'll ever be playing yeah, tonight. Yeah, it's true. I was trying to find a good retro shirt, and this is what I had. But oh, it, it's not as retro. Cars. and Well, that's true. Not as retro as the games we're playing tonight. That's right. Correct. Okay, so let's start it off. Uh, let's get the timer up. Five minutes each. Nice. I'll give you a controller. We're going to try and minimize the amount of time between the games so that we'll get more game time. But as soon as the timer goes off, we have to I reach over and turn it off. Okay, fair And then enough. I load the next one. Fair enough. So hopefully these are clean because if they're not clean, then I'm just gonna. If they don't turn on immediately, then you're going to the. I'm gonna go to go to the harmony cart. Fair enough. Because yep. I've got them all on the harmony cart, just ready to case. go, okay. just in case. Excellent. Because that's too much cleaning. I'm not gonna clean hundreds, of, <laughs> hundreds of carts. Yep. I don't have time. Don't have time for that. Okay. I will start the clock when it works. Okay. Um, so let's switch it over. Is everybody ready? For the start of, yeah, lack of couch I was compliance. Going, I was going to <laughs> mention that actually, because uh. that is very, very true. There's no couch compliance happening tonight. There's like the opposite of it. Yeah. Nothing is settable there's gonna by be, joystick. There's going to be a lot of groaning. Getting oh, up. Yeah. Oh, oh, man, groaning. <laughs> well, that didn't work. <laughs> Not at all, I know why. Never mind. Something's not on? Nothing's on. Oh. Well, some things are on. <laughs> They're on a switch, so I don't have the oh, fair enough. always going. Okay. Everybody ready now? <laughs> there Yay! we go. Yay! Woot! 1977 technology. And the timer has started. Excellent. Hopefully it's not too loud. I'll have to adjust that. Ugh. First groan of the day. Okay. <laughs> we'll do the built-in one because that ah! is what most people think of combat right it's this but in fact most of the early games had a lot of variations no it's not totally unfair <laughs> i don't i don't play this game at all no <laughs> it's gotta, gonna be awful gotta learn this the the movements no of, of the no. bullets 
Not good, not good! <laughs> I can't move, I'm moving so slow! So am I. Well, I'm not even moving, I'm just shooting you. Oh, you oh, got one in. finally! <laughs> Oh, you can curve the... Oh, I thought that you knew, knew I was doing that. <laughs> no. Oh, no wonder. Yeah, you can curve it. Now I'm going to die, right? No. Games without title screens. Yeah, it's just straight into the game. There's no room for title screens. Oh, I want an exact angle. I love the spinning, and you can warp across the screen. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, nice. no! What, what, what's the final score? Is it by time? It's time, yeah. Then we'll go to a plain one if we have time. Oh my god. Of course you... No, I think it pauses you too, right? You can't move until I stop spinning. Oh. Nice. Atari games are pure mechanics, nothing distracting, pure fun. Yeah. Yep, exactly. And that is what I love about the Atari games. They are just... Straight up mechanics, if they're good, they're good. Oh. And they were very well honed for fun. Hours and hours and hours. Oh, time's almost up. You were catching up. Oh, no. Oh. And all the old school ones had um, built-in screensavers too. Oh, did they? Yeah, because after a while they just oh, it would uh, burn change, in on the screen, wouldn't change it? colors. Oh, all there. done. Hardy has the screensaver. Nice. Eight to sixteen. Whew. I have time for one more game, so let's go to something very, very different. Uh, let's go for planes. Oh, cool! This oh. one's a little harder because you're always moving. You can speed up it's as like, well um, and the, slow down. The, the Top Gun game we were this playing. This is exactly what. That uh, that game was emulating. Yes, it was this variation. So good of combat, air combat. <laughs> Ooh, oh my god! Now you know how to play. I'm gonna kick my ass. Mm. Oh what? Oh, it just stopped just before. Oh, this is not steerable bullets. This one. Oh, so close. Oh. All you have to do is maintain your score. Ah. And you're good. So I did play a lot of this. Oh, oh nice. Tied caught up. me on the edge there. Oh, come on. Nice. Okay, timer, go off. <laughs> <laughs> timer, do your thing. Oh, 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 yes! Solidified the lead. I think everybody who had the 2600 has played this game because there's so many copies of it. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. oh my god. Oh, come on! I shot you first. <laughs> oh! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. How much time is left? Ooh, under a minute. Oh, that went right through you. I think it was uh, mine, my bullet. This one's great because it has like clouds you can hide in and turn. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh stray bullet. Stray. Oh! oh, last minute. Oh, oh. four to eight. Four to eight. <laughs> There we go. Okay, off it goes. Mm. Next one. Air Sea Battle. This was also a one of the first of nine releases. So I am orange. Tanya is. Am I hitting you? No, I, I think we're just uh, competing for hitting the planes. Oh, I see. Okay. Tanya's blue. I am orange. 
So it's like, uh, not against each other, but You're... we're just going for points. Oh. And in this one, you have three different directions you can aim. Just, oh. uh, straight. Uh, How does it work? Oh. Just up, down. Oh! Up, down, or nothing. And you have the three different directions. Oh my goodness. Oh. I can try to get on this. Oh, just missed it. Yeah, it was perfect timing to end exactly when... Uh, oh, I got it just before you. Cool! This oh, is like come Space Invaders. On. Except you can't move. <laughs> oh my goodness. Nice. Terrible. Ah! So fast. Ah. Was only one. I'm anticipating them. Oh, they're coming out this side now. Oh, it's way easier. It is actually. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, because you get a shorter shot. Yeah. You almost get two shots in. I mean, you get I... multiple shots in, actually. You do. You do from. Not that I'm doing very well, but. Because it's easier to anticipate them. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! <laughs> My timing is so I bet bad! This, I bet this did inspire Atlantis. It is almost like Atlantis with the two on either side, except you get a middle one with Atlantis. Oh. Come on! And you have to wait for your bullet to come back. Oh, uh, come on, come on, come on! Uh, uh. Uh. My cat. He's rummaging. He likes to rummage. He's, he's a rummager. <laughs> oh! Ah, that was terrible. <laughs> okay, can I have to deal with this cat? What? Very quickly. Well, hurry up. He's playing with batteries. Oh, God. Yeah, you're back, cat. Sorry. I don't think so you're supposed to... No, you can hit everything. Oh, no, I didn't I get a can't. point. So you have to avoid the... Um... Oh, you can move! Oh, you can... What? To the center. Okay, that's better. Have we been able to do this the whole time? Uh, maybe. <laughs> I don't think so, though. No, just this round. So the, I don't know if the bombs lose a point. No, they just don't do anything. They just get in your way. Which ones? The ones at the bottom? Yeah, the mines. The oh. Mines. Oh, they're mines. They don't. They don't do anything negative. They just actually get you can in your just way. shoot them to get get them out of the way. Yeah. So they don't subtract a point. They do come back though. They do. Ooh, that was worth a lot. This is one of the earliest games to reuse sprites going down the screen. Ah, yeah. yeah. I bet it is. We'll have to take a look at the other um, the other games in this series. Obviously, Combat uses one of each of the different uh, sprites. Uh, the playfield for the... Playfield. Uh, each of the player characters for players and the missiles. It just doesn't use the ball in combat. Ah. Oh, they didn't quite get the timing on the right hand side of the screen though. There's a little it's a little jump uh, for the uh, I'm guessing background. I don't mean they could have used playfield, but I'm guessing it's um, the background color. A little jump on the right hand side. As we go through these games, the PAL ones, I uh, don't know how well they're going to cooperate with my system. So we might have to emulate some of the PAL ones. But that's not till later. So I don't think there's. Oh! Oh, well, okay! Time's up! Next! James won! Next one is uh, Starship. Starship. I don't remember playing this one. Looks like a shoot the things. Shoot the things! I don't know what I'm doing. You're not shooting the things. Can you steer? No. It's oh, you. why is it player two? Weird. 
I guess I'm playing. So all these first nine that we're playing were all released on um, the same time, around the same time, so September 11th. September 11th, around the time the console came out? Yeah, so there's... Oh, I, th I think I have to avoid those. <laughs> I have not played this game very much. I think I'm, I got a point. Getting points. You're getting points. Yeah. Oh, now you lose points. have to avoid that. Points. Very nice. Read the chat. If there's anything. Uh, yeah. This was one of the earliest games to reuse sprites going down the screen. Can yeah. you imagine how clever a trick it was when it was first <laughs> figured out? Oh, yeah. yeah. So cool. Very. Oh, oh, there's like a. Buggy. There's buggy like dude. A bug in that's, the sky. That's a pretty and great it looks graphic. Slightly like a toilet. Although when it gets closer, I'm not really sure. I mean, that's this was also to be. this was also a, a first release, and there's there's multiple. Well, actually, there's only two, so this one doesn't reuse. I bet that's a player zero and player one for the two different things. Oh. Some of the is, oldest games use the right joystick for player one. That's strange. Yeah. I didn't even know that. I bet some people were like, "Why isn't this game working?" Yeah. <laughs> well, they had manuals. Yeah. When I bought these games. Um, from Value Village and yeah. flea markets, I didn't get any manuals. Everybody threw away both the boxes and manuals. They got or they destroyed, lost or they got lost, or yeah. kids kids chewed on them. I don't know, <laughs> like <laughs> cats. Cats chewed on them. Kids, Dogs. kids too. It was yeah. the seventies. That's true. Kids ran wild. That's right. <laughs> come home when the street lights come on. That's right. Oh, 31. Does it crash into you if it gets too close? Yep, it does. <laughs> Is there lives? Or do you just shoot? You lose points. Okay, there. 33. Excellent. Your turn. All right. Two minutes. No, there's nothing like that. Let's see another variation. <laughs> I'll just, I can he keep hitting this button all day long. Oh, what's going on with this variation? No. Let's oh, it's two, two players, it looks like. Are there are two scores? Right now? Oh, maybe. I don't know. Now it's this one. What is going on? Here, you play. I don't here, understand. Here, here. Are you playing something? No. Well, why are there two scores? Um. Let's see. Oh, I'm kind of. Uh, I'm kind of controlling the enemies. Oh, I guess you can't kill them. <laughs> no, you have to avoid those. Oh, okay. Good to know. You're like just... when I press the button, I I disappear, but what? only for so long. Oh my gosh. Oh, come on. <laughs> but I only control one of them disappearing. So you have to guess where I am. I have to guess where you are? Hey, Mr. Zarnawoop, welcome back. Yeah, because I'm... I'm like warping out. Come ah, on. here I am. Ha <laughs> ha. I don't know how I get points, though. I don't know. I mean, so mine's I... at zero, and I just press. I can move it, and I can press the button to disappear. Well, I can't do that anymore. There we go. We're not really sure what we're doing. <laughs> You're kind of playing it's as fine. if I was playing too. Just trying to avoid asteroid fields and. Because I can move the character, and you can also steer the character into your sh into your shot as well. But there's Are you one I can't. Are supposed to block my shots? I I'm just controlling one guy, and uh, I can make him disappear. That's all nope. I can do. Ah! Oh, you got me anyway. I was mo I was hiding. All right. Okay. Next one is Indy 500, which uses. Actually, these are all working. That's yeah, amazing. shocking. <laughs> well, well, you might have. Which uses the driving controllers? Oh, you might have jinxed that. No, no, no! I didn't turn it on. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll, I will reset the clock because this oh, uses driving controllers, okay. so we have to switch controllers. All right, fair enough. Hold this. Yes. Hopefully, it's in port one. Actually, I think it's two player. Mm -hmm. So I'll play, put both of them in. Oh, cat. No. 
He likes um, the Velcro ties. because they make noise. Yeah. He's right on it. Oh, he loves the Velcro ties. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Good to go. Okay. I know this one. Ready? <sighs> go! I'm orange. Tanya is green. We did play um, a bunch of games that were... The menus were remade by Omega Matrix. So we have played older games on the show before. Was this one of them? I think it was. I steer so well. That is Dude, one of the actually, awesome uh, things about the 2600 is it. the amount of inputs. You. Different oh. types of joystick controls and paddle controls yeah. and driving controls you have that just are not available on new systems. Not as available. I mean, you can get steering wheels, I guess. But, like, like um, trackballs? No. There's no such thing as a trackball anymore on any system as far as I know. Um, yeah, I would think that Starfield effect was the ball just kind of flickering all over the place. Because it was very flickery, so I don't think they put more than one ball on the screen. They're just like repositioning the ball every uh, couple frames or every frame. And this one also doesn't use more ah, than... No, let me again! Nice! Oh. Doesn't use more than the players, uh, the play field, and I'm... I'm guessing that is like uh, the ball making the... Um, the lap end, or the finish line. Because they're just making it going down the screen, starting, going down the screen. Uh, it's one pixel width. These first couple, these first set of games, we're both going to be playing, so I can't read the chat as much. No, well. Because they're mostly two-player games, because there's true. no AI. People weren't as, uh... Well, people were just learning the system. So this is learning by time, program. right? Like, at a certain point, it's going to stop, or, we, or is it by laps. laps? I bet it's laps. It could be time as well. I don't know. It's a lot well, of laps. We'll find out. Well, it's not 20 laps. Well, nope. Probably time. Probably, yeah, 21, 25. Because with time, you can do it with um, players that aren't very good, right? True. That are very slow at playing. Ah, still slamming into walls. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I think I was better at the beginning. Oh, I was definitely worse at the beginning. <laughs> Much better now. Oh, I didn't reset the clock. Oh, no. Well, that's okay. We'll add a couple. We'll just play past it a little bit. Are we playing different? Oh, 25, 25, I guess. There you go. Four player warlords, yes. <laughs> With paddles and some beer. Ooh, there we're. Nice. Ooh. Is this a scratch up derby? Maybe. Let's try that one. I'm blue, Tanya's yellow. Oh, what? What? Oh, I'm. What? It is crash up derby, but you have to do laps? No, it's no laps. But the number's going up. It's the amount of time that you're... You go oh, it's unimpeded. tag. See, I'm flashing. Yes, you have to get me. Oh. oh. And then it switches. That's what's going on. Now I have to get you. Ugh. Ugh. Ah. Nice. I love it. This is a great variation. <laughs> <laughs> we'll play a little bit longer. We'll play this one till the end. Let's uh, put in the controllers for this. And unwrap them. Oh, I have to get you. Yeah. I forgot. I was just it, thinking it, it was me. Back and forth. I have to watch who's flashing. Uh, oh, no, no. Oh, my God, that was close. I don't know. This is probably time. Uh, yeah, I'm because it's guess always so. going up. Or maybe it goes to a 50 or 100. 99. 
You know, turn around. Oh. No! Nice. I keep getting caught. Ah. That's why they're there. Ah. Ah. Sometimes, oh, come like, on. sometimes the higher variations are actually the more fun game. I think you're right. And I didn't realize that when I was first playing Atari that the ver there's no, so many different right variations. Never get any score if I keep hitting walls. And I didn't know what each of the variations did either because I didn't have the manuals. Come on. Come get me. <laughs> come get me. Ah. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, damn it. <laughs> this is perfect with the holes through the walls. Yeah, you should have got me there. I know. Uh, because it provides like a tricky escape. Oh, oh I should have got you there. I swear I touched you. But you're also flashing. But it's pretty rapid. Ah. Oh, I bet it goes to 100 or 99. It might. Oh, 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 90. Oh, oh. Ah, 100, you're almost there. 95. 98, no! Oh, we are the same speed. I was wondering that, whether the chaser was like a little bit faster. Oh, damn it. Oh, come on. 99. 99, there we go. Really good take on sprint games. Variations yeah. are what made this console special. So much customization. Mm. Yes, because it's like just a little tweak. It's like, oh, it's mm. a new, di different play field. Or if it's it's like, oh, one thing's faster or one thing disappears and it's just a tiny tweak in the code. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I let it run. Let's pause that. Uh, the next one is Street Racer and that is Paddles. Mm. I will just stop the time right now and pause it. Is it? Oh, it's paused. Yeah. yeah. I like the driving controller song. Keep spinning. Yeah, you can spin right around. That's the difference between the paddles and the driving controllers. Kitties, please come on. Oh, come on, kitty. <laughs> it's just so lazy now. It's like, eh, I'm an old cat. You work around me. <laughs> Aw, Atari cat. <laughs> He's like, this is my console. Uh, yep, yeah, I claim this off. console. I claim this in the name of the gray cat. Atari the gray. Atari the gray. And I have the... Oh, that one works too. Actually, it's pretty good. These games still going after 40 plus years. 40 plus years. It's all twisted up. Hi. Okay, ready? So I am orange, Tanya's purple, button to go faster. I'm not, why am I not moving? What? Let's see. Oh, that's weird. Like that? Oh yeah, they're both, they're both plugged in. Oh, kittens, no, 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 don't ruin, don't ruin it. Oh, kid. <laughs> oh my God. Kitten. Squish in your stuff. Okay. It's working now. Okay. I don't know what that was. Okay. You ready? Okay. I'll reset the time. And start. Oh gosh, I already crashed. Wonderful. That's okay. I wasn't even touching my, my controller, so. Ugh. Oh my goodness. So it's risky to go faster. This is one risk reward, right? Risky to go faster, but you get the more points. Oh, <gasps> they come at angles. They do move. I'm right for you. Some of them are straight. Some of them come at angles and you don't know where they're gonna be or which direction they're gonna go when they come on the screen. Ah. Or if they're gonna box you in. But it's paddles and you can go whip right to the uh, left or right. I should be reading uh, who's mate who makes these games. Um, I'll do that in a after. second. Ah. Ah. Oh. Uh, Trying to go really fast, it's not helping. <laughs> I think it's if funny. you go slow, they go straight. It's uh and if you go fast, they start moving to the sides. Oh, God. Very clever. Very clever programming there. 
So if you're not, if you're a novice and you're just like not pressing the button to go fast, it kind of goes, it makes the game easier for you. I love the crunched up cars though. <laughs> smoosh, smoosh. Yeah, some bent axles going on there. It's funny because these games, you just pick them up and you can play them. They're yeah. so simple in how they function. They're like very obvious. Some of the ones we were playing tonight are not obvious, so you'll have to bear with us on that. Oh, caught my tire. Is this to 99 or is it oh, a timed wait. one? Ah. Oh, gosh. So many variations like the skiers. Oh, we will do a skier one after this. Because all they do is change the look of the thing and the obstacles, right? Instead of a car, you're a skier. And instead of cars, it's, you know, trees, right? 81, 82, 83. I don't know what that first variation was. Only I could move. Like 86. All right. That's fun. Kind of claw and ball. Interesting. So here we go. Can you move? Yeah. No? Yeah. Okay. So this is like skiers going through slalom. The slaloms. Instead of like posts, they're like openings. Oh. Which makes sense. It's an easier way to do it. So how are they oh doing gosh. this? Are they just? Is it play field scrolling down the screen on both sides? Too fast. Too fast. Oh. You hold the button and Caught then my edge of my ski there. Oh my gosh, I do that so much. Like the back edge. Yep. Like five in a row in the same spot. Wow. Yeah, I guess it's play field, a uh, separate play field on each side. And then one in the center, that's constant. Oh, uh, it would be a riff. Um, repeated play field. Because the left and the right look the same with a line and then a little space and then what you're supposed to go through. It's pretty, I like it. It's, a, it's yeah. pretty simple. Oh, God, my edge. This one's a little bit easier. Um, yes, it's less, uh, because they don't move, that's why. Well, yeah, because the cars move into you as you're, which is feels really kind of unpredictable. Ninety nine. Oh, good job. Maxed it out. <laughs> Wasn't there all some with a claw and a ball? Let's see. Yeah. Uh, there's another car one. Mm -hmm. Looks like things going down the screen. Planes. Uh, adding. <laughs> oh, here's a weird looking one. I think it's just like four players. Weird. Let's do that one, but the first variation of it. That one, sure. Can you move? Yep. Can you move? Yeah. Am I supposed to get that? I think you're supposed to get the pluses, but avoid the... Oh, gosh. Oh, no. I crashed no. on a plus. Oh, does it change? Your thing changes? Yeah, it That's does. a bear? No, not supposed to get the bear. Oh, gosh. I got the first plus and I got a point. Oh, we're out of time. All right. Where's my Taiwan. sheet? Woo! Oh, my sheet Power. over there. <laughs> um, so this is by Larry Kaplan. Uh, last one was by Ed Riddle, Street Race, um, Indy 500. Bob Whitehead uh, did Starship. Larry Kaplan did Air Sea Battle. And uh, Larry Wagner and Joe DeCure did uh, combat. Ooh, do, you, do you go like this? So the next one yeah, is... Yeah, that's what how is you it? do it. You capture it, and then you drop it off. Oh. So there's there's something the with a specific... Um, I'll show you in a second. So you, you pick it up. Yeah. And then you can get more than one. Oh. And then you they'll be them? they'll be... No, there'll be something that comes up, and then you... You'll see it in a second. Sorry, I know I'm delaying it, but there. Oh. Thing. Oh, and you match it. Yeah, you match it. Oh, very ah. cool. Okay, now Video Olympics, which is Pong. And luckily, it's still using the paddles. 
Yeah. Get the plus, then dump it in the other one. Uh, Neat. Oh, that also one works too. Wow. Hey, Dan, watching us on his new Fire TV. Fancy, fancy. Excellent. Okay, so this is Pong. So we'll do a two player just so we can both play. <laughs> That's more credit than they ever got from Atari. <laughs> <laughs> yes. People knew afterwards. Oh, you ready? Oh, it's fine. It's fine. I'm terrible at Pong. Oh. Oh, Pong. <laughs> oh, Pong. Oh, you Pong. You knew they had to include Pong as a release of cartridge. Of course. People would be like, where's my Pong? I grew up on Pong. <laughs> Played it in the, in the bars. And I oh, want Pong gosh. on my home console so I don't have to put quarters in it anymore. Very small paddles. They're tiny. Teeny, teeny. Teeny paddles. Oh, I should restart it. You For can what? get a point. Oh, I got a point. Are there you? you go. Oh, there. Okay. This one has, yeah, it has a lot of variations. This one. Because there's different sizes of paddles. There's a wall on the left. You can play one player against yourself. Two players. Is this the standard one? This like is, the starting one? This is kind of... It seems really teeny tiny paddles. This is kind of pretty ah! standard. I could probably set it to like a different um, variation so the paddles are bigger. Oh, so there's like a handicap, but we need oh, some gosh. points. We need some points on the board. Yeah. Oh. So it's not zero zero. Yeah. No, that's fair. Yeah, that's what I thought. The difficulty switches change the paddle size. Oh gosh. <laughs> Actually, these paddles are behaving really well. They're yeah. not jittery at They're all. They're very good. Driving controllers were working really well too. They they work a little differently. They work like joysticks. Um. So they're not. Um, what is it? Oh, got me. What's, what do the paddles work on? What is that component inside paddles? You talked about Not a resistor. It's a transistor. Uh, no, it's. Oh, well, somebody in the chat can help me. Oh, um. But they get dirty. Um, and the oh. the driving controllers are just like scrolling oh, through like. On variations of a joystick so they don't have that piece in it it's it's kind of like moving a joystick around the the driving controller potentiometer that's thank it. you very much the train yes. that's the word i was looking someone's for someone's listening <laughs> yep oh trying to get the edge of it i know are you winning or no no you, you're winning because you missed it so many i've times. missed it a few times what so am I doing? I'm, I'm like trying to kind of hit it and move, and then I, I run right past it. You're watching this on your CRT? <gasps> That's so awesome. Oh, oh, oh my nice. God. How big how big is this CRT, and how do you have it hooked up? Is it like um, VGA out from your computer, or do you have a, um, a down grader, <laughs> like HDMI to composite adapter? We were just talking about that the other day on the show, about how somebody um, <laughs> oh. hooked up their computer and played, um, what's that game? What was it, just a 10? Uh, nope. Oh, thanks. <laughs> uh, that's Sorry. one way to do it. I, 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 that was an intentional. <laughs> I just it is Video Olympics. One of the first nine release games on... The the Atari 2600 nat back in 1977. Ah, uh, palm. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay, well, next point wins, and we'll go to a um, another variation, because I don't know how long this is going to take. Okay. You win. Woo! <laughs> There we go. There's that looks time. interesting. Oh. This is kind of like foosball. It's doubles pong. Yeah. Doubles pong. It is doubles pong. <laughs> oh. Or like volleyball. Two on two volleyball. Or, or doubles pong. <laughs> or doubles pong. It's like doubles tennis. Ah. Oh. They probably called it doubles no. tennis. 
Because they're like, oh, yeah, it's tennis. Yeah. It's like, what? I told you, doubles pong. Ah! So that line is a person? Oh, sure. come on. Okay, we'll, we'll use our imagination. <laughs> it's so small. <laughs> Don't like it. Oh, gosh. Oh, 21 wins. Okay. 21? Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, because if you hit it, you have to be careful not to hit it off yourself, back at yourself. Mm -hmm. But, and if you can get it, or did it go right through you? Is it always forward? No, no. You can bounce it you, back you on yourself? You can ba bounce okay. it back on yourself. But if you hit off the first one, the, oh, the, ah, damn it. The returning person doesn't have much as, as much time. Oof, oof. No! Oh. Some rallying going there. Oh, you can also spin it off. No, you can hit it. You can kind of hit it off yourself. Yep, you oh. can. It does. It oh. changes the direction of it. Oh my god, that was a fast one. Ah, damn it. All right. Okay, we're That's done. Video Olympics. Video Olympics. This is actually a very good game. Yeah. Because there's a lot of variations. Yep, yep. yep. Um, so, Video Olympics was uh, made by uh, Joe DeCur. Mm. Next one is Surround by Alan Miller. Ozzy Moto says, if memory serves, was described as foosball in the manual. Uh, okay. I like doubles I palm. Correct. <laughs> calling it doubles palm. Um, I have uh, the variation called Chase. A lot of these have different names. Okay. Uh, this is also called Blockade as well as Surround. Okay. This is still part of the But first Chase nine. is the same one. Uh, yeah. Same game. Yeah. So they, why why so many different names? Uh, they probably wanted to try and sell them again. <laughs> well, I don't have Chase. What's Chase? Oh God, I rebought the same game. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I have to restart. Yeah, right. when I switch when I switch controllers, I'll I'll restart it because yeah. that's you, like a whole minute off. Yeah. Okay. I think this is two player to begin with. Everybody knows this game. It's Tron Light Cycles. Worms. But of course, Tron was not out at this time. So, it's not Tron Light Cycles. Uh, uh, uh. Let's see who can draw best. <laughs> pretty much what it comes down to at this point. I think I have more space. Oh, brutal. You Just look for manual Foos Pong. Seer oh, Sears had a particular love of rebranding. <gasps> <gasps> what? That's not supposed to happen. That's a good way of handling it, though. Because some variations of this game would be like, yeah, player one always wins. Now you're in trouble. That was a good way of handling it. If both are on the same spot, like you can't crash on each other. You can only crash against a spot. Oh boy, I think I've screwed myself here. Yep. Just have to hope you make a mistake. Uh, that's likely. <laughs> I don't know, you have big open area. Oh god. Made a mistake. Just trapped myself. Oh, I'm out of space very quickly here. Very, very quickly. Oh boy. Yay! I could have gone for another six squares, but it is. There's didn't. a drawing mode in this one too. Interesting. Oh, might as well. Yeah. Do some pictures on the screen. What? Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh boy. Hmm. I thought that might might have might happen. Let's see what happens here. Ooh, yes. Now I just have to not screw up. There's also a mode where you can do diagonals. Really? Ooh. I would not be skilled enough to do that, I don't think. Now I'm gonna hear this in my sleep. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Turn it up a little bit. It's a little bit quiet. Sorry. If 
you hated that sound, but it was just a little quiet. Oh, there why did we I go. go to the left? Speed up mode is best. <laughs> okay, so let's do another variation. Just sure. Time. It's pretty simple. I don't know what they are because they all just have numbers. This one's different colors. This one's pink. It's not diagonal. Blue, pink. What's happening? Am I controlling this guy? You're you're yellow. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm yellow. Tanya's blue. Got scared, eh? No. <laughs> oh, there's no edge. Oh. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, it's open left and right side. Hmm. That makes it harder to trap people. It does. You kind of have to trap them top and bottom then. Now I just make lines. Ugh. Yeah, it's not the speed up mode. Yeah, speed up would be better where it gets faster and faster. I just totally trapped myself. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> oh. Which is this? Yeah, this is drawing. <laughs> oh, drawing. Oh, there on? we go, speeding up. I'm not... Oh, is this computer control? I'm not, I'm not doing it. Oh, that. wow, we found uh, the first AI one. Cool! It is speed up mode. Let's go faster. Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the most intelligent. I don't think he plans out ahead. It just kind of goes. Yeah, it's like a zoo. Oh, damn it. Ah, <laughs> oh, I had a good lead. Oh, you're Six seconds. Done. That no. tone would drive me nuts. Yeah. I don't think I can get the last point. I'll play to this one, see if I can get it. Oh, top and bottom are open too. It looked like there was a line on the top. Oh, oh well. Yeah, he's trying. Yeah, variations should be mentioned Yay. on the cart la labels. Great. Oh, there was like 128 on some of them. Oh, yeah? Um, but some of them had like the basic. Yeah. Um, variations. Okay, so that one was by Alan Miller. Now we're going to play one that uh, we're probably not going to understand how to play, but it might be more straightforward. I think I have the cartridge somewhere, but I couldn't find it. Mm. So if you can load up Blackjack, please. 18th? Uh, yes. And start the clock. So I'm guessing you're betting now. So up, down, left, right. Try it. No. Okay. Start it right now. So what? A jack and a seven. So stay, and they've got a six. I would stay. <laughs> That's sixteen. How? How? What is going on? Are you not doing anything? No, I'm hitting it, but I'm not picking anything. I won. I won. I hit to the right, and it went. Oh, it's probably an instant thing. It's like, oh, up for this or down for that. And then yeah. it automatically does it. Oh, Blackjack uses paddles. Oh. I do not have that in my notes. That's probably why it's not working. Because up, down, left, right is fire on Ooh, paddles. That makes sense. So you actually pressed fire when you went. Yeah, I was like, uh, what did I do? <laughs> That makes it better for betting, that's for sure. Does it? Well, there are so two paddles, working? and you don't know. Ne oh, you're, 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 you've got it. Okay. So, 25. Jack and a three. I will hit. hit. Oh. Jack three five. Stay. 19, right? Jack? No. It's, it's nine. 18. Jack's a 10? Jack's a 10. Ace is 11. I win. All the monies. Jack and a. Ooh, stay. Never understand what double. Double down. Oh, if you have the. I lost. Oh, did they hit uh, Damn 21? You. 5, 3, 4, yeah. 9. No, 22? What? 
two. Or, or do you have the you have the top? No, I would know my two cards, right? I would know my two cards. Right? I'm in the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. So I would jack stay. and ten. Yeah. Stay. Uh, so that's a twenty. So eleven. Eleven, 15. fifteen, twenty one. So they won. Yeah. That's fine. Okay. Try again. Thank you, Dan, for letting us know about the paddles. Uh definitely hit. <laughs> Nine, eleven, twenty. The queen. No, nineteen. Nineteen. Stay. Oh yeah, sorry. Yay! Yay! Win! Now I'm broken even now. Yeah. Double your bet and take only one card. Oh, you you only pick one card. Okay. Hit. No, no, that's for double. Bust. Oh god. I would have done that. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Oh my goodness! Stay. I think I'll stay. stay. Give me my money. Back to 200 again. Uh, 20 beaten with 21 twice. Rigged. Yeah, agreed. Yep. 20. Come on. Ooh, come ooh, on. Ooh, yes. Oh, yay. BJ, Blackjack. 25. 8 and... Ooh, I will stay on that. Nice. I'm up. Walk away. <laughs> <laughs> Walk away now. Walk away. 16. Ooh. Ooh. I'm going to stay. Hit. Yeah? Do it. Oh. <laughs> Way over. Way over. I'm still up. Ooh, nice. Oh. Stay on that one. Yeah. Come on, let's go over 300. Got a minute left. 15. Ooh. I'm gonna hit. 15 so low. Nice. Yeah. 19. Yay. No, oh, lose. 20. 20. Oh, no. Jack and a boo. Mm, 17. Oh, stay. stay. Oh, come oh, on. Just 12 up. 21. 38 seconds. 10. Obviously, hit. Uh. Oh, oh, now I'm down. Can you car count in this? <laughs> uh, I don't know how it works. I'm going to stay. Um, I doubt. I doubt it. I bet, I bet it's just totally random. <laughs> yeah. I lost. Oh, one last one. I think. Mm, 17. 17. Stay. Yeah. Oh. I think it is rigged. House, House always, always wins, Charles. You are correct. Should have walked away when I was up. Oh, oh. Okay, 15. last one. Hit. Oh. oh. Stay. Bad luck today. Oh. oh, yeah, that's right. Ace becomes a one. That's I right. Black oh, I should have hit again. Damn it. Um, so that is uh, Bob Whitehead. Uh, nice. Did that one. Now we're going to do basic math. <laughs> you ready for basic math? Well, according to my adding for blackjack, I need it, so... Uh, yes. This is joystick. Got a joystick there. Mm -hmm. I'm sure this is a one-player game. Basic math. This is on... I, I, I'm sure I have basic math somewhere, but I couldn't find it. Or I just didn't want to buy it back in the mid-90s. Why would I buy basic math? What? Can you do anything? Oh. Is it the other one? Sometimes it's the oh, other man, one. I didn't start it. There we go. Oh. What am I adding to nine? I don't know. Do something. One plus five is... Time to practice your multiplication tables. Yay, good job. Oh, are you doing just ones? No. I don't know what this is. No, you picked one. Oh! Let's do multiplication. Oh. oh, no, don't test my brain. Okay, you have to pick your starting number. So Zero! Not, not zeros. That's what do too I, easy. What do I hate the most? I always hate an eight. The start of edu edutainment. Yes, the Dark Souls of math games. <laughs> um, so this was made by <laughs> Gary Palmer, who apparently did not do any more games for them, at least from 77 okay. to 79. Hey, Gary, come in and do our math game for us. Okay, bye, Gary. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. That's all I did. This is also called Math and Fun with Numbers. I 
I want to do this, you do this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Oops. Oops, I happen to be on A. Okay. Do I, no, I just leave it, that's why. Yeah. Eight times five is, oh no, 40. No, you go to the left, go to the left, there you go. Yay, da -da 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 -da. Eight, eight, sixty-four. That works with a joystick. Nostalgic. I actually had this game when I was a kid. <laughs> ah. Did you play it? Was did it like the speak and spell? Did you learn stuff? Did your parents force it upon you? Yeah. It's like, well, if you play an hour of video games, you have to play an hour of math. Yeah. Six eights, forty-two. You're like, ugh. Forty-eight. Math. Oops. Damn it. <laughs> See, I do need this. Nine times nine is eighty-one. There you go. Oh, it goes up. Do, 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 do. Seven out of ten! Yay! Some of that's your fault. <laughs> it's all my fault. <laughs> Let's see what else they Not have. The Divided most... buys. How do they handle this? Uh, it's let's just do play. a it's just seven. <laughs> seven divided by two? <laughs> oh, good. Is there a decimal place? No. Oh, that's... you have to put... It automatically the did remainder? the remainder. It already did the remainder. Did it? Or do you have to do the remainder? No, it, it filled it in. No, you put in the remainder. You're supposed to put one and remainder one. Oh, okay. Seven divided by four is one. Do you put that in the remainder? Well, I wasn't. It was saying it was it was right. I don't know. Is it right or is that the sound well, that's wrong? Did it look Send Move to the right to put in the remainder. Do you have to go over two? Maybe you have to go yeah, over two. Yeah, maybe two. So that's uh, two, remainder one. Yes, yeah, so you have to go over two. two. But what's okay. the other one there for? Two decimal places? Maybe. So that's one, remainder two. Yay, I'm learning! <laughs> Is this common core math? I don't know. Uh -oh. Hey, it changed it up. I went to a new level. I'm out of the sevens. Yeah, good job. It's like, you did all the sevens. So funny. Common core. I don't, I, I've heard of I Common Core. I don't know, core, yeah. But I don't, it's I like doubt it. crazy. I looked at it once and it was like, what are they doing? <laughs> this is the long, hard way of doing things. Yeah. It's, it's so weird. It's like they do round numbers. It's like, what's 83 divided by 4? And they're like, well, then you have four tens, so you have to do tens first. And then it's like, oh my god, what a waste of time. <laughs> um, next one is uh, so a game. It's Breakout Yay! with Paddles. Breakout. We know this one. And I believe I have it. And it's also called Breakaway 4 for some reason. Breakaway 4? <laughs> Why it's rebrand, rebrand. Oh, breakaway nice. four, breakaway IV. <laughs> Maybe. Where, where's the other ones that? Where's breakaway? Where's one, one through, through three? three? Yeah. Maybe one through three was put out on like those Pong systems. I have to look that up. Here, four players. Maybe. Oh, ah. oh, it might be. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, Sears version. Yeah. Why though? Why? Did they break away one through th one through three? Oh, there's a little black cat in your spot, just so you know. Oh, uh, this one's not working. Oh, I break no. away four from Sears. Poor kitties. Yeah, you're sitting around waiting for some treats sometime, eh? We're doing treats. Nobody's giving the cats any treats, I know. poor kitties. Okay, let's redo this one because it's not working. Ready? It's one or the other, remember, it's two paddles. Hi, stinkies. Oh, God, I'm terrible. It's Pong again, except it's against a wall. Rainbow Pong. It's Rainbow Pong. And this one is done by Brad Stewart. Yeah, Sears had different names than Atari games. Because they didn't have the rights to the names. Ah, oh, that makes a lot of sense. 
because a lot of these were arcade games or they were like literal Atari games. But that doesn't make sense. Why would Atari go, no, you, you can have our game. But not but the you name. not can't have the name. Was it that the original designer like, or programmer didn't want to give Sears the name? Well, this one is an arcade game. So it must be for the arcade games, maybe. It must be. Yeah. Just funny. Maybe they it's, wanted more money and Sears was like, nope. No. It's moving too fast for treats. We can pause for treats. Oh, look at this. Look, look quick. I can't look. Oh, oh. He, was, he was a complete ball. Oh, he's a complete set sprite. Yeah, he's, oh. he's a ball. He had a, a stinky accident today. Oh, yeah, right before the show. Oh, Good it was times. panic time. So that's panic why he's cats. super cuddly now. Okay, your claw. What are you doing? You're being weird. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh out restart. of lives. Restart. Oh, I've got a cat. Oh, I'll take him. Let's do another level. Oh, he's purring. Oh, Let's cuddly this one. cat. Cat. Okay. I don't know what this one is. It looks like it's, it's like level three one. one. Three one. Maybe it's faster as it goes up. Oh, you're so cute. Looks the same. Yes, you are cute. Oh, maybe. Fewer lives? Maybe. I'm losing them at a very rapid rate. This is made by Brad Stewart. Oh god, oh. terrible. So much messages. Messages? Just people chatting? Messaging me right now. Oh, like personally. Yeah. So it's all over my screen. Hi. Oh, you're so cute. Is this easier or harder? Exactly the same? Feels exactly the same game oh, okay. to me. Feel like you bounced over. This one seems like very advanced compared to the other ones. Versions of um, Breakout, you mean? So this one was actually September 7th, 1978. So this is the first one that's not in the, the first nine. This came out Almost a year after the Atari 2600 came out. Mm -hmm. So this is the first of 1979s. You My turn. Yep, your turn. I don't have much room here. It's okay, I'll grab the kitten. Thank you. Oh, hi, Stinky. Oh, they didn't even make it reset with the button. Hi. Hi. Oh, no, he doesn't like me. Oh. I was cleaning him up earlier. He's like, oh. nope. No. No. You're the mean one. You're the mean cop. I am the mean cop. You're the bad cop. Yeah. I'm the good cop. No, oh, someone has to be. Yeah. You were a little cute little kitty though. So I, that's that makes sense why this one seems so much more advanced, with all the, the mm. massive amount of colors, and like all the stuff that this game has to remember. Yeah. Like it has to remember every single spot at the top. Yeah. It's licking my pants. <laughs> Why are you licking my pants, you silly cat? He's grooming himself. Ah. Like, maybe, maybe you would like some grooming. <laughs> Whoa! I think as you hit, um, oh, a it goes, certain, now it's going faster. Because I hit a certain spot. As soon as I hit the um, orange. It oh, went, like, nuts! So as soon as I hit the orange again, it's gonna go fast. If I make it there. Mm -hmm. oh. One ball left. I think it like doubles the speed, which oh, is way too fast, fast of an increase. If this is a homebrew game, I would suggest them to slow it down just a little bit. Not go. Oh, if I can get up there. Damn it, that'd be so good. Come on, get up there. Come on, yes. Yes! Stay up there. Nope. Oh, it's small. Did my paddle get smaller? Oh, it did! Probably because I made it to the top. I'll just play this out because I'm going to die soon. Oh! Yeah, there we go. Very fun oh, game. Oh, when you hit the ceiling, the paddle gets smaller. Uh, nice! Uh, next one is Hunt and Score. 
And he uses the keyboard, so good luck to us. We have a keyboard? Yeah. Oh, we do. Yeah. The keyboards. Ooh. Oh, these keyboard controllers. Yeah. It's like an actual QWERTY keyboard. Oh, good timing. Oh, good timing. Good timing. Who's hungry? Everybody's hungry. The cats are hungry. Oh, there's stuff all over the floor. It's okay. Let's unplug these. Get out of the way. Get the keyboard controllers going. Get the kitty treats going. They're like, where is it? Where are the treats? They're somewhere. Can you put, get, Can you see them? put them on the opposite side. Can you see of them? the caps. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Does this one give me treats? Does this one give me treats? Oh, both of them get a treat. <laughs> Both of them get a tree. Here. Over there. Over there. I just threw it on the ground. Silly cat. Both of them get okay. treats. Yeah, I know. I know. Okay. I know. Charles Whelan, thank you thank so much you, for feeding the kitties. It was very good timing because we had to get the keyboard controls out and unraveled. It's the first game with keyboard controls. So? In the meantime, I can bring up the... Good kitty. Um, That's real. Don't let the, don't let the black cat eat it. Bring up the instructions for hunt and score as well. So I know what that is. Black cat's oh, frantic. Around. Hit the bell. Good kitty. Good kitty. <laughs> there we go. Oh, not found. <laughs> good kitty. He's too good at it now. He might be a little loud. Sorry if I'm blasting your ears. Oh, good, good kitty. Good kitty. <laughs> good kitty. There we go. Good kitty. <laughs> How to play. Monsters. Monsters. They are. Treat monsters. <laughs> good Can you see them? Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah? Food motivated <laughs> monsters. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> so cute. Yes. So cute. Sprite is like, if I ring it a ton of times, that means tons of treats, right? Atari's like, ding. <laughs> there you go. One ding is enough. Good kitties. We have to, we do have to um, stop at a certain point or they would just continually get, get treats. They would get so, chonkies. If you hold these, please. Okay. I'll plug them in. Good kittens. I don't have the cartridge for this one. Oh my god. <laughs> Troubles? Yeah, doesn't like. Harmony cart does not like that. Keyboard controls? <laughs> yeah, plugged in. There we go. Okay, now I can plug it in. These are very nice looking keyboard controllers. They're very cool. Very clean. Like they've never been used. Rarely used. Yeah. Okay. Start fiddling around. Uh, oh, I guess I better start it. Each game version is played the same. The only difference, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's get to how to play. Mm. Oh. Oh, okay. Those are just the numbers. Start pressing uh, the numbers on the probably the first one. Or the second one. No? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, press enter the, the number. What? The number sign. So if I go press one. a number and then press there you go. It's a butterfly. So now you have to match it. With what? Another number. It's like match up, I think. And then enter. Oh. Nope, tables. Okay, try again. Well, maybe we can both play. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I get oh, it. Oh, we can both play. Oh, it's your turn now. No, I get you. Bell and a ladybug. So oh, it is your turn. turn. Yes, okay, okay. So. Bell. That's what I just chose. Should have laid it out like these are laid out. Yeah, they're not. <laughs> but I, I guess uh, they. You pick the number. It's your turn. Uh, a man in a hat, and uh, oh damn it! 
Where was the ladybug? <laughs> oh, brave. It wasn't there. What? Oh, I was thinking it was the... Oh, that's a bell! Oh, God. I'm not gonna give you a hand. Crab? A crab, eh? Did, you, did they scroll the numbers across the screen because they couldn't display them all at once? Yes, they didn't what have they the doing? knowledge to do that yet. Crap. Okay, go. <laughs> I am terrible I, 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 at memorization, I, I, so... I'm just... My brain's not in it right now. Two green birds. All right. Uh, okay. And a man in a hat. Mm. Mm. Where is that man in the hat? Oh, God. First match. Boot. Do you get to go again? I'm guessing. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a crab. Oh, God. <laughs> You're going to win. I'm terrible yeah. at memorization. I can't remember what we have and haven't done. Here's the ladybug. What I mean, was it's it a, at the bottom? It's a, clever, it's a clever way of displaying the numbers. Yeah. When you don't have the knowledge to to uh, draw something different. Oh, you already Birdies. knew that. Man in the hat equals ranger. Oh yeah! My. <laughs> that uh, was lucky. I don't think I can even catch up now. Butterfly. Where's the other butterfly? Is it one? Uh, <laughs> oh no. I forfeit. <laughs> I can't win. That was... I don't think we've seven. seen the other one. Or three. No. <gasps> no. No. Oh, that's oh. a new one. What's the other one we haven't looked at? Ah, oh, it's the, the yeah, table chairs. Yeah, get some chairs. points. A couple points. They almost could have done it with a joystick and no numbers. They could have done it with a joystick. You just completely pick like it. just do 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 yeah. up and down. But you ha you have to justify the and you don't even need the numbers then control. if you have the joystick, mm. right? They they should have done it with the joystick. Yeah. They wanted to sell these or use them. I was going to say, they have They're to like, justify the keyboard controller's we need, existence. We need another game for the keyboard. <laughs> it's a shame they didn't think of Whack-A-Mole back then, because that oh was God, an awesome yeah. use of the keyboard controller, the homebrew. There, you do this one. Oh, it's a that. bigger one. Oh, my goodness. Your turn first. All right, what am I going to start with? Okay, cats. Can you not? Oh, my God. It's the deer. We only have 30 seconds, so I wanted to see how big it got. Okay, the deer in four, castle in eight. Yeah. <laughs> Butterfly in, in 20. 20. Spaceship in 23. Got all that? No. We have 10 seconds to get one match. No, oh, jeez. Crab. Car. And a little ladybug. And down. And two deer opposing each other. <laughs> With their tails and twine. That's not bad. That's not bad. No, game. It's, it's it's it works. It's um basically uh, that flip card game. What do you? I that was you September seventh, nineteen seventy eight, as well by Jim Huther. Also called Memory Match and a game of concentration. Memory Match. Yeah. Now we're gonna play Hangman, of which I do have the cartridge, and that is joystick. As far as I know, switch back to the joystick. Uh, I don't know if we use these again. Can I get a drink while you switch the joystick? Yes. Okay. I'll be right back. Hi, kitties. They've all left now. They've got treats. Yeah, they're like, meh. Like, man, we're done with you for another hour. We know we don't get fed for another hour. Uh-oh, Hangman's not cooperating. Let's see if we can clean it in my 2600. Yay! All the dirt transferred to the 2600. Or corrosion. Okay, so we'll wait for Tanya to get back. Hangman is September 7th, 1978. It's the third game on September 7th. Um, its code is 2662. All these have codes. I haven't been reading them out because they're not very interesting. Um, this is uh, by Alan Miller. Uh, it's also called Spelling. Okay, it's hangman time. Yeah, good stuff. Here you go. 
I cleaned off the dirt off the cartridge into my uh, RGB modded 2600. So it's nice and dirty inside now. Oh, what? So, you cleaned it into? Well, you just move it in and out. Okay, let's nice. restart the clock. So, you have five letters in the word. Are we go back, going back and forth? Sure. Or are we, okay. So you picked an E? No E's. So it deletes the E's. No S's. Mm -hmm. Yay, dirty contacts. Yeah, I should clean those out soon. T. Oh, okay. T. Let's go for an A then. What is that? Give up. <laughs> no A. Mm. Maybe it's yes. An, an I. Oh, maybe, maybe yes. Uh, no, why would you need to guess? You just guess more letters. Ooh, no O's. Mm -hmm. It's got to be an I then. Yay, dirty contacts. It's an I. I. You thought you. Uh... I don't know what that would be. Because it's hard because you don't see the letters. Ooh. Try G. Mm-hmm. Fight. Fight. Might. Right. Right. Could be a lot of things. Mm. Fight. Oh, don't cry. Night. Night. Hey, hey. I'm guessing night. Oh, no. <laughs> Gotta be fight. fight. Nope. Ooh, what's left? Light. Good. Oh, yeah, this is one of those games where the, the crowd can help. The chat yeah. can help. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh, no. You failed me, Charles Reese. You failed me. <laughs> Bite, no. Zite, yite, zite, bite, vite, yite. Right. right. Yay. Yay. Oh, it's a monkey. Oh, I remember. I think there was a thing they didn't want a person. They didn't want oh, a hangman. Oh, yes. It's a monkey it's hanging. It's a monkey. Okay. Next. is Are there different versions or is it just um, one game? Different colors. No, there's not too many variations. Let's try five. Whatever. Oh, I don't know. Four letters now. Oh, it's two player. Well, no, it was before. What was it? It showed two oh, players. No. No, it didn't do it. We used to call it Hang Monkey. <laughs> Hang Monkey. Let's see if it's two joysticks. Nope. Oh, yep, yeah, oh. I'm guessing. Sure. Hey. We used to call it Hang Monkey. I mean, it is a monkey. Oh, my turn already. Mm -hmm. Sure, T. I did, I did oh. tea. It's funny it stays on that. I guess that makes sense. Jeez. Oh my god! Oh. That's not good for me. Can't. Oh no, you get another turn. Oh. This is all also That's... called spelling. Feed? Ooh. Seed? It's a lot of eeds, so I'm gonna go for a D. Oh, what would be two E's? Oh, I know one. Nope. Meat. Oh, no. Oh, I know another one. Yeah, well, we're competing against each other. Hey, that, that, that. Hey, that. hey, That's hey, the one hey, I was going to hey, guess. Don't hey, look at hey. it. Oh, you cheater, cheater. Nope. Uh -huh. No, nope. it's not that either. Thank you, Charles Reese. <laughs> <laughs> um, Jeep. It's not a P. Did you did you choose a P? Uh, no, not yet. I'm gonna go for P. Oh, it is gone. Uh, he heed. Beep. <laughs> I think there's one left. Weep. There's no P. Re. Leer. Leer. Keen. Mm, I it's, a 70s, it already. it's a 70s word. Keen. Super keen. I don't know. Weed? I think we did D. Did we do D already? Oh yeah, we did D. CG. He. he I'm it's lost. more like what it ends in is more Weed? important. Weed? No, yeah. D, D's gone. D is gone? D's gone. W. We got W. And C? 
What would it end I in, just though? lost. What, this is our last shot, isn't it? Yeah, eight seconds. Key. Oh. Eat, geek? geek? Hey, it's my turn. Oh, no, you oh. get to go again. Oh, it's geek, isn't it? Weak! Oh, oh no! Oh, right on the time. Yeet! That's Yeet. period appropriate, right? <laughs> Super period appropriate. <laughs> Perfect ending. Oh, mm. now it's brain games with the keyboard. Oh, boy. This mm. one is... This one's a lot, so... I think we won't be able to figure this one out in time, but we will try. Brain games. Yeah, I tried to read it up quickly. It's with the keyboard. No, put that in the floor, please. Yeah. There's more room for me to do stuff. Hold that. Okay. Fairly complicated. Okay. Just figuring out how the game works. Is that the uh, issue? Yeah. Okay. Let's try it. Let's give it a go. How do you play? <laughs> uh, go. Uh, I'll try and read it off. Let's, let's can you read it that. really? Yeah, read it really quick. If I can. Brain games. Uh, use your keyboard controllers. The computer plays a sequence of tones. Oh, it's matching. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like the top six. So press one, the two, pound three, key four, or five, something six. to start. Or one of the numbers. I think it went. It flashed Oh, it up. did already. Oh, okay. Could we hear it? There it is. So it was one. There we go. Yeah. Never mind. It's not complicated. <laughs> it's very simple. Pretty easy so far. Yeet is forever. Yeet is eternal. What? <laughs> it's level one. It's all the same. Hey, psst, psst, psst. no. Why would you do that? You know I don't like it. squares for. So this is Merlin on the 2600 pretty much. Pretty much. Simon, not Merlin. Merlin. I mean, I bet Merlin had this as well, but it's Simon.
I don't remember. <laughs> wow. 19. I lost it. Yeah, that's your first time. I lost it. Wow. I lost it when the beat when the when the timer went off. Oh my oh. god. That's insane. <laughs> I wonder how many levels it has before it rolls over. Good question. That's insane. Well yeah, oh. there would be a memory limit, but that's... I'm better with sound than I am with things. <laughs> I can yeah. I can memorize sounds pretty well. Did Tanya play a lot of Simon? No. Nineteen. I can't do like 10. I'm better with sounds. Like I'm better eight, with sounds. Maybe. That is amazing. Um, and visual. I can memorize visual <laughs> things. I like like um I can keep a pattern in my head, but but the sounds help a the lot. The sounds help a lot. Yeah. Um so this was uh made by Larry Kaplan. Um, That's a cool game. <laughs> this, yep. September 7th, 1978. So now we're moving into September 17th, 1978 with a Space War, which is back to joystick. That was unbelievable. <laughs> really, really, really good. I'd love to see, though, the people who, who like, compete with that kind of thing, how far they can go. I bet it's insane to think, like, the amount, the patterns they can memorize. The, the people who, who do, like, pi to the oh, 200th yeah. digit are, like, oh, my God. who do that. Yeah. So yeah, but no, but that's that's repeated memorization. This is memorization on the spot. That so is I would true. say that's a different thing. It's a little bit different. I but, bet they're pretty good at it. As oh well. yeah. Um, space war. There you go. Mm -hmm. So this is actually space war. One of the very first video games ever made. I think tennis was first, and then space war it's, on the like oscilloscope, combat. pretty much. But there's like gravity or oh. or you're bouncing off the walls. Oh, that's fun. Ah! 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 Space war! Ah! Oof. Did so you, you can... hit yourself? I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, oh, yes! You got Finally. Me. You have to wait for your bullet to come back to you. Oh. Or to expire. You ah. so close. actually a lot harder than combat. It's cool. Switch back to the web to watch you now. I'll have to go to bed. Well, thanks for tuning in, Dan. Yeah. A lot of these I have never played on the 2600. Like, I've never Ugh. played this game, even though... Um, it looks like a pretty... Uh, pretty simplistic game. It's... It doesn't seem like it would be the one that would come out a year after, but it is, you know, a hole in the... Um, it's it's a well-known game oh, you for the I system. Oh, either. Huh. A well-known game, so that it's not surprising that they would. I think I'm just gonna wait till you line up. Oh, and you then kinda have go to, because you can. You can't really control you it. You can after. a little. You can speed up and slow down a little you bit. Can. Oh. Precursor to asteroids. 17 years earlier. Yes. Wow. Yeah, this is an old, old game. So the 60s? So you won? <laughs> nice job. Oh, I didn't start the timer. Oh no! Um, we'll get to see some other variations. Oh, there's the planet with the gravity, I believe. Ah, gravity planet. Oh yeah, it's sucking you in. Oh, God. 
Can you not hit it or? Uh, I think you die if you hit it. Yep. yep. So you have to and keep driven. watch. Not ah! only, not only of. Ah! Oh, nice. That was. Oh, that was close. Oh, damn it. To... <gasps> no. <laughs> to watch your. Oh, where did you go? Oh, you can uh, press back for invisibility or hyperspace. Oh, oh, you just turn off and on. But you also don't know where you are. Oh, weird. So I don't know if that's much of a good thing in this. Because you might hit I? the planet. You have to press down again. Oh, down. Oh, okay. Oh, and your bullets. Do your bullets get sucked in? Mm, doesn't look like it. No, no. I hit the it. planet. Ah, could hit even, the planet. Even, 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 um... Stop it! Where's my bullet? <laughs> nice. <sighs> Kicking my ass this time. Oh. I know how to play now. Oh, I can't turn. Oh, it's oh, over. Oh, it's over. 1962. Wow. Oh, yeah, these old games. Um, oh, boy. What is going on here? These old games had crazy colors. For some reason, early Atari games are like, we don't... I don't know what's going on. I can't use my bullet at all. Do I have to go get my bullet? No, I... Do you? I don't know. Give me my bullet. Come on. Nope. What is this? <laughs> Nothing's happening. Like Nothing I is happening. Can't shoot. I'm sure it's something. Press start? No, I did. No. Funny. And there's just that one. I still can't shoot. So this is like a game variation that you can't actually play? Is that the idea? <laughs> Just have to hit you? No? I, I don't know. Do I, if I to... try and touch it, it doesn't kill me. It's like wondering if... Mm -hmm. Try this one. You need to dock with them? Dock with what? Your own? Your zero? <laughs> Let's try and get our own colors. How do I... Easier said than done. Yeah. Dock with what? Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Just gonna oh. do the DVD thing and bounce. <laughs> and then we go to come the on, top. Come on, come on, come on. And bounce. Oh. What? You have to press bounce. a button or something to dock? See if he ever hits the corners. Bounce. <laughs> bounce. Those are your bases. You need to dock with them. Okay. I'm trying, but it's really hard. What am I. You have to get the same gravity as them, like the same bounce. I don't know how you would do that. I don't know how you do that. You need to match their speed and trajectory. Oh, That's insane. Wow. Because they're constantly moving. Okay, this is definitely one of the more challenging ones. Or maybe there's like a easy way of doing it, but yeah, I can, I can barely move. Like <laughs> my 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 guy is just bouncing. This seems difficult. Yeah, it is because. What is going on? You have to try and figure out where they're going to bounce, but by the time you figure that out, they're like way off doing something else. <laughs> and it's not easy to speed up and slow down. It's a very I slow thing. get it. Yeah. Isn't that funny? Yeah, that's not going to... This isn't going to work. This seems <laughs> difficult. I... Yeah. I, I, yeah. Oh, it, oh, one player docking. Let's just do the planet again. For the remainder of it. Oh, you shoot the. If you shoot the sun, you're you don't get your bullet back right away. Damn it! Damn it! Where are you? Where are you? I hope you're oh! oh! That was lucky. That was the wrong. Oh no! Shoot! 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 Come on! Where's my bullet? Do I not get my bullet back right away? Oh, what? Do I right through you? Come on! <laughs> oh. well, at least I got you on the rebound. Oh. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Careful of the sun's gravity. Yeah, it is dangerous. You'll slowly get pulled oh. into it. Where are you? Well, lucky you didn't crash into the sun there. All right. Pretty good. Yeah, Pretty good. fun. Fun, fun, Some fun. good variations there. Croc FL, what game is this? 
Uh, this is Space War from September 17th, 1978. Now we're going to go to Outlaw, which is a much... I do have that, that cartridge, which is uh, was a, an arcade game. I don't know if... Yeah, I think Space War was as well. Actually, Space War, wasn't that oh, like wow. the first arcade game? And then they went, oh, this is too hard for people, <laughs> too hard for people to understand. And they, they put out Pong. They put up Pong not because that's all they could do. Yeah. It's because people understood Pong because it was easy to mm. understand. Okay, let's just start that again. Yeah. Okay, ready? Oh, Ooh. just just missed my feet. Oh no! Oof. Oh, this doesn't have a destructive. <laughs> Not the first arcade game, but... Hey! Psst, psst, psst. Don't be a pixel. <laughs> Don't be a pixel? Is that what you said? Yes. Don't be a pixel. Stay away from up oh, there. No. no, you gotta stay close to the... to the cactus. It only bounces once. Oh, yeah. Oh! oh double hit! Can kill each other. I thought at one point your bullet disappeared when I hit you. I guess it didn't. Oh! Double hit! Nope, that is not the case unless you hit the cactus. Ah, figures are so big. They are. They're hilarious. It'd be like when uh, Street Fighter came out. It's like, oh my god, they're such huge sprites. <laughs> 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 These are like quad sprites, I think. They're really big. It's a game about angles. It is. Woot! Oh, man. Oof. Oh, no. Oh, you almost got me. And after you shoot, you can't move for a second. So you're a little bit vulnerable. I think oh, that's no, no. the idea. Yep. Ha-ha. <laughs> yeah, there's one player target practice as well. We'll have to do that one. One player. Oh. Oh. Okay. We'll <laughs> uh, there's a variant with a car moving across the screen vertically. Yep. I remember that one there too. There it is. Yeah. There's the target practice. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Uh, there's a computer museum in Mountain View, California, where people can enter the lottery to play this on a PDP-1. The type of machine is developed in MIT in 62. Oh my goodness. Wow, that would be so cool to play that. On a... On a System made in nice 1962 computer space. That's what I was thinking. Not not space war. Computer space. Um, it's Outlaw September 17th 1978, made by David Crane. Cool. So this is David Crane's first Atari game. First Atari game. Yeah. Very cool. Let's go to the two player with the moving cart. Oh, yeah, it's hard to do the angles now. <laughs> you have to anticipate the cart and where it's going to be. <laughs> also, you can't hide behind things because you're out in the open a bit. Oh, man, this one. Ah, oh, gotcha. Doesn't bounce off the cart. Oh, oh that was just snuck it through. Oh, Oh, I didn't mean to hit up. No, stop hitting up. How did that one get you? Because it bounced. Oh, damn it. Whoa. Oh, oh, I was trying to hide. Oh, damn it. Oh, got your hat. <laughs> your hat is vulnerable. <laughs> yeah, yes. It, it's, it's a pretty great game. It's, the mechanics are fantastic because um, yep. the, 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 the pause is what gets you. It is. Without if, that pause. If, if you don't shoot right. Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> one by one. Uh, this is just ah, destructive. Oh. Lots of memory taken up with this one. <laughs> well, not that much. Ah. Oh, caught you in the hat. Right in the hat. 
right in that. <laughs> oh, damn it. I gotta get behind this. No. Oh, there's an opening now. Damn it. <laughs> Lots of good variations, too. Love this game as a seven year old. This would be a very good game for a young kid. Yeah. Well, it's really... if you don't mind the shooting. <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, just the mechanics of the it. The mechanics are fun. Because it's very uh, simple to understand. You just move and shoot, and the big, colorful characters. Uh, kick my ass on that one. Woo! <laughs> so, David Crane's first uh, Atari game. Um, so, this next one is also September 17th, 1978. It is Home Run. It's a baseball game. We'll be able to do half an inning. Oh, look at those characters. Oh, wow. Who am I? I don't know. Oh! What? So you're hitting. Ready? Ah! Oh! Home run! Oh, no. Ball. Out. Out. <laughs> so, so. Oh, it's my turn. Damn it. Damn it! Run, 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 oh. run. We didn't make I it. I don't get it. It's a foul ball. I'm not even hitting the button. It's playing. I don't know what's going on. No, you just hit the button and you threw, right? No, but... Okay, don't do anything. I'm not... Okay. Oh, it is a computer. Let's try this. It's okay. You play on your own. You play on your own. <laughs> this is too complicated. <laughs> it's almost easier to have you play against the computer, so... Okay. Yeah. So just to pitch. show it. Oh, you have two. That's weird. Two pitchers? Why is there two pitchers? Is it easy? Oh, curveball. Out, out. Oh, mm -hmm. you got to run in. Oh, now it's my turn to bat. That's way too early. Run, 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 run. Nice. I guess if you get a run in, then it sw switches up. Oh, out. He's not very aggressive about getting two people out. Nice. Okay. Hit. Go, 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 go. No! Now it's my turn to strike. Oh my god, I'm so fast. Why am I so fast now? <laughs> That's weird. Oh! You have to get the ball first. There is no, no! ball. Oh, home run. No! <sighs> oh, what? Another home run. You have to catch it. Oh, I think it's going over my head. Maybe it is. Okay, not, no more fastballs for you, buddy. Only curveballs. 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 Lots of strikes for you. <laughs> you can't deal with the curveballs. Run! Yes. Come on. Ah! Run! No! <laughs> Run! <gasps> Run, 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 run! Oh, I didn't make it. Okay, only curveballs for you. Oh, how did he just automatically go to first base? Did I hit him in the head? I think I hit him in the head. Mm. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Very arcadey mm. um, baseball game. It's kind of fun. Because mm -hmm. it's so simple. Oh, what's that? Foul ball. You beamed him. Beamed him in the head. I did. Okay. Out. It's the fastest game in baseball I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> yeah. It's like, what inning? We're in inning four? Wow. <laughs> it's fast. Nobody's getting a... Well, he got a lot of runs in. I've got nothing. I've got no score. All That's... the games I ever see, there are no runs, and you just sit there forever. <laughs> yes. Forever. I can't get anything in. I can't even barely get to second base. No! What? How did... What? I don't know. That was weird. No! No, no, no! You all get out. No! Oh, oh no! no. You, gotta you gotta get in. that ball. Oh, no! no! It's just the... It's just the... Oh, there you go. Whoa! Triple play. He didn't even try. Which is 
fine. I don't mind that. Well, sometimes it's... I mean, there's no first baseman. If there was, he would throw the ball to first true. base. <laughs> it's only a home run if it goes dead center. Ah, thank you, Dave. Oh, M -A -Z. Ah. So I'll try not... Oh, oh, I got him. Nice. I'll try not to throw it right across the base. We've got 16 seconds to finish this game. <laughs> well, I'm not going to win. I'll do... Oh, my goodness. Oh, cat anger. Very cat anger. Oh, cats. Foul. They look like little crime scene body chalk <laughs> outlines. They kind of do, but they have their their feet move really fast. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. All right. That was Home Run by uh, Bob Whitehead. Now we're going to be playing Slot Racers by Warren Robinette, um, which I don't have a cartridge for. Can you pick it, please, slot racers? What is this about? You can go to the right to go. Oh, oh I always forget go. that, yeah. I think it's a race. Oh, oh my goodness. What it's is happening machine. here? It's oh, a slot machine. Yep. I'll start her maybe, up. Maybe. Yeah, it looks like a slot machine. It's cars and. Oh, it's this one. Here you go. Um. September twenty oh, fourth, nineteen seventy eight, CX twenty six oh six. Wrong game. Did no. you pick the wrong game? No, it was slot racers. Yeah, slot racers. Uh, also known as Maze. What? I think you picked. You must have picked the wrong game. Didn't look like it. To the right. Slot, slot machine. machine. Oh, there we go. Thank, Thank you. you. I just I just saw time. slot and uh, went for it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm green. What are we doing? Shooting? We're moving and shooting. Oh, we can only go in one. Oh my God. What is this about? Why can't I shoot? Because you're not pressing the button. Um, I was. So forward is move forward. Then there's left and right to turn left or right. Am I not barely moving. Well, it's very slow. Barely I'm, I'm barely moving too. And when you get shot, you go nuts. <laughs> Everybody goes nuts. Oh, I have to avoid you too. Oh. I can stop. I'm going the wrong way. This is not helping me at all because you, you turn in the direction you're going. Yeah, it's very interesting play <laughs> mechanics. I want to turn. Oh, why am I not turning? You have to press left or right. Uh, no, but like I, I'm hitting it. I guess I'm just being too. Press left. No, I'm, go... I'm, I'm doing it too soon or something because it's not turning. You have to do it when the turn is there. Yeah, I'm yeah. doing it too. Oh, now I stopped. <laughs> Super bizarre. <laughs> Super See, I'm turning left, but I'm not turning left. Because you haven't got there yet. No. <laughs> turning left, yeah. and sometimes it's just not turning. I think I'm doing it too soon, is all I'm yes. saying. Yes, yeah. You can control your bullets. Oh, okay. So if I do that and then I turn right, no, you can't control your bullets. You control your bullets when you shoot them. So if I press to the right and I... Yes. You can't control it. You can only control it when you shoot it. So if I press right, it'll constantly go right. It if I press not move very fast at all. No. It's can you speed, speed up? No. You don't really speed up, do you? You can slow, you can slow down. By pushing backwards? Stop. Is that the problem? But I this keep is the slowing myself down? This is the max speed. Cats! This is a weird game. <laughs> it's a very strange game. I haven't quite figured out the movement. It's very strange. Oh, your bullet! No! Do the bullets go forever? Oh, until Not you shoot forever. again. Not forever. You can recall your bullets. Can you? Yep. Oh, yeah, you Whenever can. Whenever you want. So if I go left... Uh, it'll still go left. Very interesting mechanics. 
Ah. Turn. <laughs> ah. So you can control your bullet. Cat war. It does sound like a cat war, isn't it? The cats are playing cat war. You can control the bullet when you shoot it, but not afterwards. Like it always goes around in the same yeah. circle? Yeah. Or if you shoot it straight, it'll just keep going straight until it's forced to turn. So if I do... Ah, oh, damn it. So if I do the right, it'll go right, right, and then it'll See? go for you. It's so... Oh, then it turned right it again. It turned right again. But this one isn't. You shot it straight. Yeah, you were going to hit me anyway. I, I, I have such trouble just getting it to go... Getting this silly thing to go around corners. And I stopped! You pulled back. I didn't! Game think you did. Game's, game thinks you did. It... It's, it's, um, ah. I'm just hitting an angle, maybe, and it's pulling backwards. Yeah. Very frustrating. <laughs> Doesn't really help if you both, uh, see, oh my god, it's really frustrating. It's, it's a very unique movement mechanic and shooting mechanic. Oh my god, cats. See, I'm trying to turn. It's like, no, you can't turn there. Yeah. You actually have to hold the turn as yeah. you go around the corner. When you get to it, you already have you have to be turning off. You can't turn early. No, you can't turn late. Well, like I'll, late I'll, I, I, I was hitting hitting left way too late and it just wouldn't go around to turn. That's why I was getting very frustrated. Because you can't just... Uh. I wonder what it goes to. Quickly look at the variations. Uh, uh. Oh my god. Craziness. Oh, you bounce off the walls. Oh. Wow. Yeah, this can get really complicated. Especially with the movement of your bullets. Very cool. Very mm. interesting game. Very weird game. <laughs> Very weird game. Uh, so that's Slot Racers by Warren Robinette, who did Adventure as well. Uh, basketball All is right. next by Alan Miller. So this one. Oh, cool. Look Very at that. Very straightforward. Interesting. So what are the controls? That would be nice to know. Just move and button for shoot. Pretty simplistic basketball. Hmm. You just but if, effective. You just run into the. Oh, see, you can steal it from me. You can steal it from me. Not well. I don't really understand the mechanic of shooting so much, unless you're right in front of it. Is that the only it, way? I think you hold it down for longer shots. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So if you're really close, don't hold it down very long. Remember, one player mode uses right joystick. Mm, too high. I get you. One oh, on this player? game? Oh, we'll play two player. Ugh. Oh, to shoot, you stop. That means oh I can, that I can that steal it. Holding way too long. There we go. Interesting. So you have to, the, mostly the skill comes in the length of time you press the button. Oh, I can, <laughs> I can maybe intercept it too if you I jump can. high enough. If you're if you're near me when I try to shoot, I think. Close enough. Long shot. Woo! Oh, no three pointers in this. Or I wasn't far enough away. No. Oh my god. That went in. Ah, Way back. No. Go! Nope. Passes it to myself. Yeah! <laughs> oh, come on. That should have worked. Oh. 
So getting close to the basket means you only have to press it for like a second. So there's not enough, yeah. not much time to steal to it. To intercept right? it, yeah. Oh, come on. Ah! Oh no, you can't shoot for that far. You can. Do you push the button to intercept? Uh, no, you just run. You just run into yeah. it, yeah. Oh, come on. Half court shot. Nope. Oh, it did. Mm. You've got to throw it up beneath the basket. Is that a legal basket shooting it up through the basket and then it comes back down again? Does that does that count in actual basketball? The shoot throwing it up? Well, it looks like, like when you're underneath question. it, it like puts it up and then it goes straight back down. I don't think that, that doesn't seem legal. Oh, Lord Monka says no. <laughs> oh, I didn't need to do that. Put the NBA Jam sound effects in this yeah. game. Yeah, put some modern sound effects. Oh, way too far. I don't think you can smack it out of the air. I've not been successful any of the times. Uh, you can just, if you're on the person when they shoot, then, yeah, then you can, um... Yeah. I think that's the only time when you can really intercept it. Well, you can intercept it when you're running as well, but I don't really know. I think you have to be on the person, like, mirrored with them. Yeah, but, like, after you shoot, I can't. It doesn't seem to be able to touch it. No, not after the shot. You can't knock it out. Ugh. You're better at intercepting than I am. All right, James wins that one. Basketball. <sighs> Pretty good basketball. Oh, yeah. Time's up. Um, basketball by Alan Miller, also mm. known as basketball. Code breaker. Oh boy. Uh, I think we have to do this one off of the cartridge, and it is keyboard. Keyboard controller, justifying their existence. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, who's that? Thank you, Repentless Fiji, for subscribing. Oh, thank you so much. 35 months. <laughs> Whoa, my goodness. Thank you for the support, and glad you are enjoying this. It is a whirlwind tour of Atari 2600 games. Mm -hmm. There you go. All Break right. that code. Are you, Break it. uh, oh. Break that code. What am I supposed to do? Uh. You're going to have to give some. Nope. Uh, let's see. <sighs> oh my goodness. That's a lot of text. See, the computer has made a secret code. Okay. Uh, the code is identity, uh, number of digits, game features codes with three or four digits, the number span. I think this might be like mastermind. Okay. Left controller to play, one player, code breaker. Okay, so you have one right or okay. one in the right spot. I think it's just like mastermind. So you have two in the right spot, maybe? So four. Yep. Um... So it's either t a two or a one is right. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That still would. Four, one, three. There we go. Okay, white must mean you have three correct, but in the wrong spot. So I've got the right numbers? Yes. So it might be one, three, four, three, four, one. Uh, okay. So it's trying. not letting you know whether you get it right or not. So you have to just keep guessing. Okay. Oh. Am I correct? Yeah. I'm so, doing this wrong. <laughs> no, you got it right. <laughs> Did I? I was just really surprised that it wasn't giving you anything. They're still all in the wrong order. So white as you've got them. Okay. You got the right numbers, but in the wrong spot. And this is just one through nine. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so good, good use of the keyboard controller again. Oh, it's angry. One, two, three? Sure. What? As good as any guess.
So you okay. got one of them right. Wrong spot. Another one right. No, it's one through six, I guess. Yeah, must one be. One through six. How can that be? Is there a zero? Nope. What? It's just one through six. So there's only two digits because it's saying I've got one right and one right and it's one through six. Oh. Uh, it could be doubled. True. It could be one, one, six. Well, no, it could be six, one, one. I'm like trying to figure this out here. There I like go. that error noise. Eh, so there are two ones and it'd be one one four one one five could be four one uh five one one could be one five five what? one one oh i see oh. so still not all three digits yet Shh. <laughs> thinking uh four one one two were in the right spot four one five they weren't so it's got to be a four and a one five is not right so it could be four four six one nope what did i do wrong there four one one well, there's definitely two ones four one five what the hell one 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 had two that were correct yeah, so there's two ones in it, and it's either a four or a five or a six. Oh, uh, one, one. The four's wrong. So is it... What? Five, one, one, then? Okay. Charles Wynn, oh. Yeah, Dave, Dave. Yeah, yeah, you got there. Dave it took me it. a second. I had to go back through. That's like, right, what's yeah. going on? I didn't realize they were doubling up numbers, so that confused me. There's different levels. What are, oh. what are Four digits, one to six. Four digits, one to nine, I'm guessing that means. Yep. Is that four digits, one to nine? Yep. Okay. Excellent use of the keyboard controller in this one. This one is actually a good one. Hmm. One of those is correct. Uh, 35 seconds. So it's mm. two, three, four. <laughs> or one and five. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, okay. Uh, we'll play this through to the end. Yeah, that was a good boost. <sighs> Only Ooh. one. So not nine. Uh, I'm going to guess two, three, or four. And then five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. All right. Well. No, no, no. Keep going on this one. <laughs> I want to see this one get to the end. Nothing. Nothing. So it's not a five, six, or a nine. So that means a seven and eight. Seven and, and eight are correct. Nine. So in the right spot. But then there must be something doubled up because it's four digits. So what did I put? Two, three, four, oh, yes. nine. Something is doubled up. And then a seven and an eight. So it's either seven something, seven, eight, or something, eight, seven, eight. Oh, good Lord. And it has Not to be, good at this. and it has to be a one, two, three, four. So yes. It's, so it's. And it's in, something there is in the right place. Nine, two, no. three, four, two, three, four, five. Oh, no, sorry. Yeah, you're right. So two, three, four is in there. It's seven, one, two, three, four, seven, eight, or one, two, three, four, eight, seven, eight. There's no one. It's two, three, four. You're correct. <laughs> so that narrows it way down. So we got two, three, four. We've got a seven and an eight. So the seven and eight, either the seven or the eight is in the correct position. First. So let's just, I don't know. Two, eight, seven, eight. Mm. <laughs> I'm not gonna get ah! it. Ah! No. It's the eight or the That's two. It's three or four now. The eight is in the right place. So. Three and eight. Three, so, eight, seven, eight. 
three eight seven eight. Why do you think it's three and eight seven eight? I just know. Good job. Logic wins. <laughs> <laughs> oh, because the five, six, seven, eight. Yes. Two are in the right place. Yes. Um. So nice. the next one is flag capture with joysticks. We're doing these in, in order, so I have to mm. keep switching these. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm guessing flag capture is two players, because mm. it sounds like a two player game. Most people know the 2600 for the, the mid-games, just before the crash, I think. Mm. Like around the crash. The pitfall era? Yeah. Is pitfall mid? 82, 83. Mm. Um, that's when it really took off. Um, and mostly for the Activision games, mm. too. Those are the big hitters. These early ones, like some of them. Dan ABC, I, lo I love flag capture. I used to beat my friends at it. You should build a controller switch. <laughs> well, I don't switch that much. This there is are one-player very... variations against the clock, Dave. Says. Okay. Mm. Well, I bet this is a one-player. Oh, no, nope. it's two-player. Yeah. Okay, so uh, we were trying we to find... It? This is September 24th, oh. 1978 by Jim Huther. Oh. So that's not the flag. Oh, it tells you what five? Oh, I see. Four. Three. Is that my flag? I'm looking for your flag? What's going on? Oh, did I get it? I don't no. Know. I think I'm almost there. Yeah, I got the flag. Oh. So it tells you direction and how far you are away. But then then there's like bombs. Yeah. I think those reset you. One. Oh, yeah, the bombs send you back. Yeah, gotcha. Bombs send you back, and there's arrows or numbers. So you're like, oh, and you're both, oh, and I can't go over you. So if you're already there, oh, I'm very close. There it is. Interesting. So you have to watch each other's movements. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh. You were on it. I was like, get off the flag. I know you're there. Oh. oh, that was a lucky yes. Oh, my God. Where is it? Oh. Oh. Nice. This is fun. Yeah, this is really, really well made. Oh, oh it's very close. Oh. oh my goodness. It's... Where is it? Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, the, oh, the timer's not running. Oh no! That's okay. I had to switch joy, uh, joysticks over anyway. Thank you for letting me know. Charles Whelan. Oh, whoa, where is it? Oh! oh. You were one ahead of me. It's really clever, because you're both going for it, but you're also revealing hints to each other. No! And you can also block each other. Oh, boy. oh where is it? Oh. Ah, damn yeah. it. But you're also revealing where it is. Are the bombs just random? I think they're just random. Oh, where is it? Oh, right on the edge. And when it says two, it's literally two away. Oh. All right, where I started. Sometimes you're just, you know, went ahead. Oh, 
Oh, you can scroll up. Oh, oh like loop around? Yeah. Oh, that's handy. Oh my goodness, so lucky. Yeah, it's like sometimes it's just like, oh, okay, I got it. Oh. Two. Oh. What? First try. <laughs> oh my goodness, totally unfair. But the arrows don't loop around. Ah. Oh. For that way. Two. It's gotta be there. Mm. It's a weird, it reminds me of Minesweeper a little yes, bit. <laughs> that's kind it's of... got like a bit of a Minesweeper vibe going on there. Let's try seven. Oh, no, the single. Oh, this oh. is two player. What is. What? Can you move? Oh, this is like just counting. It's not giving me numbers. Oh, so each try it goes up. Your point goes up. Two. It's two that way, then it's that one. What? <laughs> what? Is it moving? Maybe, maybe it is. Oh, it's got to be moving. This six. What? What is going on? What is going on? Some variations have moving flag. It must be moving. This is moving like rapidly. Like. Should only. This is like random almost. Like how could it be six away when yeah. it was like there? That's that's too crazy. Yeah. Let's try another two player. Oh, there we go. There's a two player. Oh, it's bait turn based. Mmm. Interesting variation. Duh. Oh, where is it? Is it moving? This one might be moving. I think moving. it might be moving. No, it's moving. It's too annoying. Too annoying. There is no flag in this mode. What? <laughs> what? Let's try variation two. I bet this is just like um, non-moving, I hope. Yeah, this oh, is non-moving. Yeah, okay, good. This is better. Joking. <laughs> no flag. Oh, what was that? I missed it. Ah, damn it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Entirely unfair. Oh, yeah, you could press it for like a millisecond. I didn't see it. Oh, that's too bad. That's really too bad, isn't it? <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's where I was going to guess. I didn't see it. I'm going to watch quick. Well, it could be anywhere. Uh, it could be. Why would you pick that? Because it was two away from you. Well, I guess that's true. No, six away from me. One. <gasps> is that technically two away? Mm, I guess it is. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, I really like that one. That was fun. That was a good, That's a fun game. Good flat, I think I'd like to know flag. what the variations actually are. Yeah. yeah. Uh, next one's Canyon Bomber. Uh, mm. David Crane. Paddles. Paddles out. Love two-player games. Are we missing a ding, ding, ding or something? Or a repentless VG just just is announcing his presence. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> just like, I'm here, ding, ding, ding. Just making sure we aren't missing something. No, it, uh, I have the volume on. Yeah, okay, good. What did I say it was? I don't know. Canyon, <laughs> Canyon Bomber. Canyon Bomber. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. You don't have uh -oh. the uh, game? Uh-oh. And it's not on that. Oh, I'm gonna have to load it. I have to load it up. Can we do the next one, then you load up? Or no. no. We're okay. doing them in order. Right. 
Here, you can read what the date is. We are is. requesting treats. <laughs> we are requesting treats. I'll throw some treats at treats? you out, out, out in Twitch land. Yeah. Canyon Bomber. Paddle game. Paddles go... Uh, I don't, don't want to plug them in yet. Nope. Okay. It, uh, oh, it's annoying. That's true. Yeah, it sometimes mm -hmm. makes it go crazy. Well, we're getting down to the last one, two, three. Oh, what? It says it's there. Eleven. La last eleven games. Oh, it doesn't in our list. sort them. This is the one I missed. It's oh, later it's in the at list. Oh, it's at the bottom. Okay. Yeah. How many more do we have to go? Eleven. Okay. We've now hit 1979 with Canyon Bomber. What? What's the date? Uh, March fifteenth, 1979. Ah. So we've gone through Sorry, two so. years of Atari games. Such a huge library of games for this system. Oh huge. my god. Huge. That's why it's so good. Can huge. You, it's hard to run out of them. No, yeah. So much selection. I mean, modern systems have more, much more. But this has got a, this must have been one of the first huge, like really big ones. Was there anything else with big libraries back? Not as big because it was very popular. Yeah. Uh, so what the hell is happening? Okay, so the button does bomb. I am green. I'm not anything. No? I'm not controlling it. Okay. No, I'm not controlling it. Bet you are not. Yeah, okay. So... The paddle doesn't seem to do anything. No. Just shooting. Doesn't... Does it speed it up or slow it down? No. Does it change the angle? We don't see the game. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Switched it away so you didn't see flickering... Flickering... Gray. <laughs> I love those numbers, by the way. Uh, the, uh... Yeah. Interlaced I, numbers? I just like them. I don't quite get it. <laughs> I, I like don't bomb when the other guys are underneath you. But other than that, just, I guess you're aiming for the high ones. You're just trying after to get as much as possible. After all, it does get a bit more strategic because you're going for big streaks of um, of towers of of the blocks, and they do fall, which is pretty actually pretty cool. Yeah, they rebuild themselves a little bit too. Oh, do they? Or are they Seems just restructuring? To when they fall. No, they're just falling. I'm not shooting anymore. Did it restart? Oh, oh you ran out of bullets anymore. or something. Yeah. Oh, maybe. Oh. oh, so it's your highest score with the bullets you have. So you destroyed me, but interesting. A sea bomber. A fun sea bomber. Oh, oh, we'll play that next. Oh, I, that was not the right time. Ugh. I'll just use up my bullets. Oh, done. 369. Yeah. Interesting. Don't miss them or you'll lose a try. Oh, here's a sea bomber <gasps> oh, one. Oh, nice. Oh. Oh, it's straight down. I'm not shooting anything, but... Oh. Looks like it's two-player, but... Now? Yeah. Whoa, whoa. Oh, you can... Oh, I see. Okay, so you have to not only... Wow. You have to not only bomb at the right time, but actually aim your navigation to the one you want to bomb. Get it? Oh. Nice. That's really cool. What? That's weird. It's, it kind of twists your mind. Ah. Oh, I got it. I'm not very good at this. Wow, it's it's kind of three D ish. <laughs> I can't quite figure it out. It's definitely the lower, the higher ones are much easier to get. Yeah, because you don't have to go as far and and um, navigate it. Wow. Oh, damn it! 
going in the same direction as them. Oh, there's an opportunity. Uh, get it, get it, get it, get it. I am yellow, by the way. I know. Oh, for the people out there. <laughs> I know, you know. I don't know. I'm, I'm, this is very, very challenging. Unless you just always go for the higher ones, but, uh. There's a big hitbox. <gasps> it's it's really big it hitbox. Which is kind of nice, because it is very difficult. And you switch directions each time, so you kind of messes with your mind. Okay. And they all come out. Oh, damn it. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's very forgiving. As long as you're in the space, you don't have to be on the boat. You just have to be within that um, area. Uh, damn it. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I know. It's like, what do I go for? <laughs> yeah, it's like, ah, that one's moving that way, and I'm moving that way, and it's already past me, and ah. <laughs> the waves are really cool. Like, the where it's a little bit of uh, stormy weather, like, like there's waves on this see in the water very clever thank you for pointing out uh, the this level oh my goodness. it is really different it is really fairly challenging uh, uh, and the other person's aiming thing really messes with you too oh yeah it's like ah it's in my am I moving that one? Oh, oh, can I get that one? Oh, not close enough. Oh, you got it before me. And I think you can recall the bullet. Ah. Uh, I'm not can you? sure. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. That's good. Because Oh, you got it ahead of me. Yeah, you're right. The hitbox is large, it's which is really big. <laughs> really nice. So they're obviously using um, software collision because it, it's literally not hitting it when you're actually aiming for it. Yeah. Oh, that's a huge oh, hitbox. Wow, it's like, a thousand. It's like Ooh. one and a half times. Oh, it's huge. It's yeah, really, it's really, really big. big. That well, that's the end of it. It's another thirty seconds. That's okay. really good game. That like, is that's, cool. That is really cool. I agree. Let's see some of the other variations while we have the time. Oh, it just goes back. Mm. Yeah, I like that one mm -hmm. better because mm -hmm. it's a lot more things to wrap your head around. A lot of thinking about where yeah. where you're aiming. The next one, we are going to not know what the hell we're doing because it's football. First of all, I know nothing about football. Mm. And secondly, I've never played this um, game of football, so it's going to be a lot of running around and mm. not much happening. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Oh, I got to plug in mine. Football? Yes. Where's the other joystick? Oh, hiding it. Oh, look at those. Oh, mine's already plugged in. That's pretty cute. Let's see if the first variation is against a human component. Opponent. Are you doing things? Mm. Mine's working. Are you moving? I don't think I'm doing anything. Do you like moving the pink person? No? No. That's fine. You play. You play. No, no. It's, it's... I'd rather play against you than than the computer, because the computer just destroyed me. Okay, who am I? Okay, I'm the... Uh, well, that was terrible. <laughs> it's, it's flicker fast, but... Uh, so I'm the white player, you're the pink. Okay, I've got the ball. I'm trying to run. You Sacked. tackled me. <laughs> Sacked. You almost need the manual for this one, as it plays diagrammed in it. We're yeah. just going to be running. We're going to be running. Running and tackling. Trying to get to the other side. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I bet there's like plays and... I don't get it. Oh, oh, I'm throwing the ball off the field. <laughs> or I kicked it. I don't know. <laughs> you can tell we play a lot of football in this house. 
knew nothing about it. What? I don't... Oh, I see. You pick a play, you press a button. Yeah, I, I don't know what plays I'm no. picking, so this is not, uh, not helping me all that much. Tower in Canada. We know hockey. <laughs> oh, come on! Yes! How does that Finally. happen? <laughs> How does that happen? Seven points! <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get you. Oh, no, you threw that it somewhere. Is terrible. <laughs> you can steer the, the football. <laughs> oh, in the air! Oh, That's it's not funny. Funny. Oh, come on! <laughs> Intercept. Another seven points! Oh, good night, Colonel Lama. Good night! Thanks for tuning in. You can watch the rest uh, on YouTube. Intercept. Oh, yes. 21 points. Look at these strategic plays. Oh, come on! <laughs> I shouldn't even just throw it. I should do what you did and just run with it yeah, all the time. Yeah, I think it's pretty dangerous to throw it. Yeah. Unless you've got a, it, you're really open. No, it's where very... are my guys? Why are they over there? <laughs> they're occupied. Why are they over there? <laughs> they're, they're waiting. They're waiting for you to throw it. <sighs> no one knows the rule book here. <laughs> no. Oh. Yeah, run, baby, Catch run. Up. Run, 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 run. Oh my god, everyone's the same yeah. speed. <laughs> Seven points. <sighs> oh, you're so close to my goal line, or <laughs> whatever it's called. Pick your play. Oh, you got it. Run, 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 hey, run, 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 run. My guy was just standing there. Get through them. No. Oh. Why did he move out of the way? Woot. My guy like threw it to you and then went off to the side. Good oh. night, Dan. Good night, Dan. No, stop backing up. No, I'm so close to the line. As a football season ticket holder, this is both hilarious and sad. <laughs> Tanya is making her way back. She's almost caught up, and she will in this next play for sure. I don't know. We'll see. Sorry, we're not football people. No, we're oh not. My God, throw Sorry. It. Oh, you got some points. You got two points for doing whatever you did. Oh, it's back to the middle. Good. I mean, this seems like a very decent football game for, for the 1979. Mm -hmm. Safety. That's it. Thank you, Charles. <laughs> there. Oh. Yes. One second. Oh, All there right. we go. Football's over. Yay. <laughs> uh, the when next. I, <laughs> Robocat says, when I don't know what to do in a game, I just press every button. Me too. Yeah, there's only one button, so there you go. That's what makes it easy on the 2600. Safety Miniature golf. <laughs> um, so that was done by Bob Whitehead, who's done a lot of these games. Next one's Miniature Golf, uh, March 15th, 1979. The past two are also March 15th, 1979. This is by Tom Ruterdahl. So we'll play two player. Okay. Usually it's that. There we go. It just goes back and forth, I assume. Um... So the ball, I believe, is the yellow, okay. and the blue is where you're aiming for. How does it work? Uh, move your blue okay. far away from you. Just keep moving it. That's your goal. It's the other blue. Yeah. Um, press the button. No. Two shots. Nothing happened. I don't get it. Or the blue is where you're <laughs> aiming for. No. So move it far away, far oh. away, far, far away. There, now press the button. So it went boom. There you go. Okay, it's so gonna you, take a second. So you gotta go down. There That's we go. That's terrible. No, that can't be right. Okay, that seemed more. Okay. 
Sorry, this is just not working. There we go. Okay. That's too close. You, you hit it like so lightly if you're that close. There you go. You have to well, you have away. to, you have to, oh, maybe not. You don't have to go to it. I thought you did. It doesn't hit it hard enough. You have to, you have no. to be way back from it. I like you you're taking a big it. swing. Oh, I see. Okay. Getting there. Slowly. It's terrible. Not the best, uh, oh my god. There we go. Yeah, you have to move back from it. Yeah. Yay! All right, your turn. Oh, you that take terrible. turns. It should be like one person then the other, but well, maybe it gets too cluttered. But you can't move back far enough on the first shot. That's like that's weird. as far as you can get back. No, you can't. But you can go left and right. Yeah, but that just is going to make it go left and right. I don't know. <laughs> I guess you could go this way and, smack and then it do really it. Hard. That doesn't help much. Yeah, it's a little bizarre. Definitely. Um, Best golf game on a computer <laughs> system I've ever done. Bounce, Bounce off. off the walls, you have no choice. Yeah. Like, that's as far back that's as, as far I can back swing That's as far back as you can swing, so you're you, that's stuck. As, and then you get a bigger swing because you can go further back. Yeah. That's Maybe weird. not the best control scheme. No. There. Yeah, there we go. Then maybe I can get close, but not get it in. Oof. Because I can't go far enough back. There you go. There we go. All right. But at least it's even because I'm going to go get water. I'm way out of water. Oh my gosh. Now James is getting water. I should play for him. <laughs> this one wasn't so bad. I feel like the cats need treats or something. He's running out of time. You're running out of time. <laughs> All right. Oh my goodness. You have to like... It's terrible. It's like, get it out of there. Get out of there! There we go. Thank you. Oh, I'm against the wall. But I guess that kind of makes sense, because when you're playing miniature golf and you're against the wall you can't yeah but that's only if you're like a couple <laughs> inches away from the wall you can smack it hard so anyway oh, one second left there we go <laughs> it's 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 an it's, okay it's, game it's, it's serviceable the layout's cool it's got little things <laughs> on it uh, just the control scheme is uh, yeah little it's a little rough little wacky it's a little rough Next one is Human Cannonball. If I if you want to load it up. played $90 for this one, I might be a little disappointed. <laughs> I'd be a bit peeved. Yeah. I'd be a bit peeved. Cannonball? Uh, human Cannonball. Human Cannonball. This game, I do not know. So this came, came out in March 15th, 1979. Nobody knows who made it. Really? Yep. At least in the records I looked up. Okay. So the wind changes, and you just change the angle. That's all you change, left and right. Nope. It's very limited, or up and down. No. And, oh, that angle. Yeah. Oh, oh my goodness. And oh then, my goodness. And then you shoot the guy. Oh my goodness, you're just gonna smack. Ah! <laughs> And then the uh, speed changes some more, so you have to angle to work with the speed. 80 is the most you can get? Yep. <gasps> oh my goodness. Because it wasn't a very fast Ouch. shot. Ouch! 
40, almost. My goodness. 28, so you want to be more straight on this one. Crazy. It looks like a first implementation of H moves all the way down to kind of, oh, you got it! Yay! I didn't kill him, yay! Oh, look, he's happy! Yeah, he's alive! I don't think I'd be part of this circus or whatever is going on here. Whoa, uh, uh, oh. oh! Bounced his head off of it. Oh, oh little shorts. Ouch. Oh, how do you get the power up? Or I guess, you don't. I guess you can't. You have to deal with the power. So this one is a little bit more power. So it would be about the same. Ah. Oh, the miles per hour. Gotcha. Oh my gosh, that's that's interesting. <laughs> it is. It's interesting. Oh, that one's further. Oh, oh it depends how further away you are. Oh, let's play that one. What is that? You have to get it through oh the hole, God. too. This one's two player. Oh, that oh. that's 30 30. Uh, I'm going to go up a little bit. Because it's still about 30. Nope. We'll need a little bit more. Oh, does miles per hour not change? Oh, it does change. It's oh, it 32. does. Now oh. it's 44. So I have to go way up. Down, right? Nope, because it's more powerful, so he has to take longer to get True. there. Fair point. But it also changes where he goes through the hole. Oh my goodness. The Ouch. shame the author isn't known. It's a solid game. <sighs> I mean, it works. It does what it's supposed to do. It's kind of a terrifying game. <laughs> <laughs> the controls are fine. The graphics are quite good, actually. Yeah. It, for it's, the time. The ouch is, is a nice touch. Oh, too far. Um, and the man and, and the way he changes when he goes through the air is quite good. The cannon's good. Like, the graphics are really good for 1979. It's a very one-note game, though. Oh. As far as I can see. We'll take a look at more variations after this one. But, um... Uh, 38... Oh my god. <laughs> you do really feel bad for this little guy. Why does his arms have to flail like that? Ooh. Oh, the moving basket. Oh my god, that that's advanced. There's a moving basket one? <laughs> oh, yeah, I do feel bad for this guy. Yeah, he says, ouch. Oh my god, so hard. <laughs> so hard. You control the basket. Oh. Oh, that's that would be more fun. Oh, 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 nice! Yeah! Woo! <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh, you're so happy. Let's I'm not dead. Check out the moving basket. Oh, ten seconds left, so. I bet it's eight. Let's see. Try that. Try to move the basket. Left to right. Oh, you moved the cannon. Ah. And the thing moves. And the miles per hour moves. Okay. That actually makes it a little bit easier. Oh. I don't think you can move the angle. No, you can't move the angle. Oh, you have to place the cannon in according to the miles per hour. Can you go over it? Oh, you can go <gasps> over it. That shouldn't have happened. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cool. It's it's interesting. Oh, you move it after you shoot. You can move the basket. In oh, that would some be variation. Yeah. Next one cool. is bowling. Put out March fifteenth, nineteen seventy nine, by Larry Kaplan. I do have the. Okay. There's cat insanity going on upstairs. You know why there's cat insanity going on? Why? Because I <gasps> took out some treats. You did. To lure them, to lure the little cat so we could capture them. Yeah. And the treats were left out. Oh. So that they're full of beans. They, okay. And treats? Oh, well, treats, not beans. But. Okay, move the ball, press up. Oh. It's a weird bowling game. It defies logic. Oh, it's not two player. Oh, well, it's okay. Oh, you have to play your frame. No, no, you can only move it once. Oh. Uh. 
understandable. Oh, it's your turn. It's actually a pretty cool bowling game. It is I a played cool the, game. I played this one a lot. It's very cute. Because I love this mechanic where you go, boom, oh, I missed it. Where you kind of do it, I do it a little bit off center, and then I move the ball up at the last second to get the first pin. Like that. Oh, I nice. missed it. Yeah, the last one's author is unknown. <laughs> this one uh, is Larry Kaplan. I think this one's a very good bowling. It's not realistic bowling, it's but cool, it's a though. fun bowling. It's, it, it's pretty cool. Because some games work better as arcadey games, right? Where it's like, oh, this isn't how things work, but nice, got a spare. Look at that. Flashy, flashiness. Ah, no. This is so cute. It is. The animation's cute. Yeah. The guy's design is good. It's very He's nice. He's multicolored. Yeah. He's got some, got some graphics going on on this one. Uh, the pins fly away, which is very impressive. Yeah. Uh, there's some player animation. This is, this is quite good. I bet this did well. Oh, oh, you got a spare again. You're going to kick my ass. Oh. This is really cute. It's not going. Oh no! That's okay. We'll have fun with this one. Yeah. <laughs> Packrat says this game is still so much fun. It is. Love bowling. It's I would super love to cute. to see uh, a homebrew updated bowling game. Nobody's oh, yeah. made one. Yeah. Well, because on this one is, seems like a really good game. I mean, that is a problem. If the original game is really good, there's no reason to remake it. <laughs> wow! <laughs> strike! Ooh, strike! First strike of the game. Nice. It's like the uh, original Dig Dug. It's so good, there, yeah. there really is no reason to remake it. Mm. Like, the, you'd only make the graphics marginally better on it. That's There's no other reason to remake it. Oh, damn it. Oh. Oh. This is on the Plus Code High Score Club, too. Oh, very nice. This would be a very good one to have on the High Score Club. Kicking my ass. Spares and strikes. <laughs> this is the only time I, I beat him at bowling and, because yeah. you're a very good bowler. Uh, I'm okay. I'm okay. We haven't played a lot in a long time, but I get a lot of strikes and fun. spares. Uh, Bowling's fun. We should play bowling sometime. We should. It's been a long time. And we'll do it for my birthday. The hat comic bowling is nice, too. Just graphic changes. Okay. Mm. Hey, I got a spare, play? finally. This keeps track of your whole score. Like, look at it. It has the strikes and spares at yeah. the top. I mean, there's nothing that you, nothing more you really need in this game. No. It's got the score. It's got the frame. It's got the ball. It's a good character. Good animation. Oh, not <laughs> <Yeah>. spare. <laughs> wow. This is fun. So cute! Oh, so cute! Very cute. Cosmic bowling, not comic bowling. Oh, did I? S oh, he cosmic. said cosmic. He said well, that makes sense because there is cosmic bowling where they have the yeah the lights and. Uh... <gasps> Another strike. Strike. Does What's... a little dance. Oh, did he? Oh, I didn't even see it. Kind of a little flashy dance. Oh, can I get it? Can I get it? Up a bit. Yes! Nice! Finally! Oh, he does a little dance. He does! Use the animation. Celebration. Do, 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 do. Oh, man. Oh. I mean, you could probably do the colors a bit better, like make the lane one color mm. rather than the whole screen brown. Mm -hmm. Like put it black at the top. Oh. No, no, no. You gotta do it just off the center, you right? Do. Yeah. Just off the center and then maybe push up at the last second. Like that is pretty much perfect. Ooh, good job. But you gotta do that on the first ball. So pretty much line up your foot with the second pin in. Yeah, that's... Oh, oh. too late. Yeah. Too late. 
I mean, it's pretty much the same as you would do in bowling. Oh, uh, center pin. Had a good run there. It's like you get the feel for it. It's like, yeah. oh, I gotta start right there and then hit it right there. Yeah, oh, like that. Oh, so close. Boop. 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 Do, do, do. Does a little dance. Yeah. Little dance on a spare. Tiny bit of celebration. Oh. I think we'll actually finish this whole bowling game. We might, In actually. the time. If not, we will finish it, because we're almost done. Yay! On the, or on the last frame. Or is that the last? That is the last frame. Was that the last frame? Oh, you got a spare, so you get one more ball. Nice. Make it a strike. You can do it. <gasps> That'd you can be nice. do it. Oh, it's looking good. It's looking... <gasps> oh, no! Uh, still a lot of good score. Yep. <clears throat> ah, I'm happy with 154. Yeah. It's better than my usual bowling games. <laughs> ah. What is the top score um, on the plus cart um, high score club? Oh, oh God. Uh, for the bowling. Kick my ass. Oh, actually, I was close. I you caught up. You did well. You caught up. You, caught you got up. two strikes. I, I got one. I got a bunch of spares in later. Very good game. Mm -hmm. I remember playing that a lot mm -hmm. um, back in the day. Uh, next one is Skydiver by Jim nice. Huther, also called Dare Diver. Um, I do have this cart. <laughs> Robocat. There should be a sprite of a guy spraying the rental shoes with the life saw. Oh, that'd be so cool. Mm -hmm. oh, a lot of these are working. I think there's only one that didn't work. Okay, uh, let's make sure it's two player. Um, so I am, I don't know. Oh, I am pink and he died. Oh. <laughs> so there's a flag for the wind. What? What? What is supposed oh, to Oh, I think you have to deploy your parachute, I guess. Oh, <laughs> that would help. So there's no wind. What is going on? How did you deploy your parachute? I think it's down. Oh. Yeah. So wind a bit that way. Oh, it's up. Oh, I see. Did well, you I didn't up? die. Or did you press a button? I pressed down. Okay. For the parachute? Mine didn't seem to work. Oh, it is down. Maybe I just waited too late. Oh, I see. Gotcha. Nobody's got any points. Uh, there's no wind. Oh, he still went to the... Yeah! Damn. One! 236 is the best score for bowling. Wow. Oh, damn it. Oh, oh you can guide it a bit. <gasps> can you? Oh, you can guide it a bit. A there little? we go. Okay. A little bit. Like, there's wind. That helps okay. a lot. So there's oh, a bit hard. of momentum. Just a tiny bit. There's a bit of momentum out of the plane. Okay, let's Kay. do that one again. 236 is the best score for bowling on High Score Club. Okay. Not quite. So you can get more accurate and let. Oh, God. I pressed the button. Yay, I'm on your pad. Aha, and I didn't even deploy <laughs> my. Uh, that doesn't help anyone, does it? Nope. Better win that way. Oh, get over, get quite. over, get over. <gasps> not quite. Oh, the longer you deploy your chute, the more points you get. Oh. I see. Oh, terrible. But you also have to land, too. Terrible. Yeah, you And do. you can't steer until you put your chute out. Oh. Thank you for following Flop Soft version 2 packet 8, I think. Oh, that was bad. Crazy name. Oh, my foot's on it. Flop soft version two, packet zero. That's what it is. Oh yeah, you oh, get lots. Oh, don't move it! I shouldn't have moved it. You get lots of Terrible. points. Oh damn it! I press the button. Me too. Thank you, Dave, for that hint. That's terrible. I've gotten worse. How have I gotten worse? <laughs> I don't know. Uh. Oh no, oh, squish. Oh, oh two that's... points, really? Okay, let's try a variation. Oh, moving. No moving. Oh, that's so hard. <sighs> oh, no, no. But they stay within your zone. Okay. That's going to be challenging. 
Okay, okay, okay. Yes, yes, yes. Ugh. Wow. Wow, you, well, you landed on it. This is hard, but... It is hard. Oh. <gasps> yeah. Nice. One point, that's it? Why, why do you get did so you, little? Did you deploy early? I did. That's why. You have to deploy as late as possible. Oh, I don't want to deploy late, though. It's uh, hard. It's risky. Oh, oh, come back, come back, come back. I oh, know. Oh. No. <laughs> oh, good one. Better Deploy with the moving ones. Deploying uh, early is definitely easier. <sighs> oh, I just missed you it. Look like you got I it. It looks like I got it too, but I must have not quite. Yeah, deploying early is much easier on this one. Damn it. It is challenging. The moving one is challenging. <laughs> oh, oh, come back, come back, come back. Yeah! <laughs> that one was better. That was definitely oh, better. Just in time. Yay. This is not bad, this game. Yeah. There's a lot of uh, different parts. A lot of variations. A lot of too. variations going on. Um, the next one is Casino with Paddles, also called Poker Plus. Poker Plus. So you know how to play poker. <laughs> Poorly, <bit>. but yes. <laughs> <laughs> and I have a cart for this one as well. My goodness, have we been playing for three hours now? No. It's 10, 20 p.m. Wow. Yeah, it's a lot of games. Okay, there you go. It is a lot of games. So, um, last was March 15th. This is also March 15th, 1979 by Bob Whitehead. Also called Poker Plus or Casino. So, you have a jack and a four and a two. Bust. Bust. I don't understand. 22. Oh, this is poker. Yeah. What am I doing? <laughs> I'm playing blackjack. Isn't, are you sure this isn't blackjack? Um, it's, it's called casino or poker plus. So there might be blackjack this, parts to it. This is, this is not, yeah, this is not poker. There's only four variations. This is blackjack, Dave. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> this is not poker. Why? What? Casino? Well, it's called casino, so, but I guess they wanted to redo blackjack. Okay, let's start again. It's not poker. I don't know why it's called Poker Plus in some variations of it. This, this is the is plus, the plus part. part, maybe. There is a poker variation. Hmm. There's only four. So a queen and a queen, obviously you stay. Is there a split? No uh, split. Double. There's a double. I don't no, know what that is. There's no split. That's okay. Don't hit. <laughs> you gonna win? Push. I don't know what push means. It just means that you both got the same score. I think game three is five card stud. Mm. Okay, let's try that then. There we go. Yeah, you start off with two queens. There we go. No, this no. is what we start off with. This is five card stud. So they have a king and a two. You have a jack and a ten. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah. I'm not very, um... Fooled. That. Sure. Ten and a five and a jack, all reds. Is that diamond and heart? Okay. Yeah, two um, diamonds and a heart. How do I... Oh, I guess. You can fold or you can bet. Apparently, 50 is fold. I guess that's just the lowest. Ooh. Uh, that's not great. <laughs> two hearts and two diamonds? Well, two kings. How, why do you have a king? 
Well, there's no pairs. There's no... I have a king. They have a king. Their count cards don't count for your cards, do they? No, no, I'm trying to beat them. Oh, for the high card. Well, that's all it is right now, right? Yeah, pretty much. Or I don't know. I haven't played five card star. I haven't played poker in a long time. Yeah, this, it's just high card at this point. And there's just two kings. I, I'm confused. Why am I betting? Uh, I've, there's other not... cards, right? Cut? Oh, you lost. Dealer wins? I don't know how to play this game. Probably dealer wins because the dealer always wins. <laughs> when they have the high card, the dealer wins. Not you. Fold. I have a nine and a ten. Nine and ten's pretty good. You don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, they've got a pair of queens. Oh, boy. I mean, we are playing poker, right? Or am I completely confused? Well, Dave thinks this one is poker. <laughs> well, it's, this is definitely not blackjack because it goes up to five cards. Well, I'm going to lose. I might as well fold. I don't understand. Dealer <laughs> had tween queen to king jack. Okay. Oh, so it goes to the it, next it card. It does go to the next card. Play one more hand. I, I haven't played in forever. Oh, okay. Why am I getting such shitty cards? <laughs> From the king? No, I'll try. Well, an ace. Yeah. That's better. Rigged. <laughs> And now they have a pair of kings. Yeah. Does <sighs> three in the same suit count? You've got oh, a pair of kings beats a single high card, right? A flush, it has to be the same suit, so but I'm screwed. Not. I have four yeah. diamonds. So yeah, sure. No, I don't. I don't, I don't <laughs> okay. know. No, I'm not used to this, and I'm not also not used to seeing the whole dealer's hand, so... <laughs> That, that I find very odd. Next one is slot machine. So this one is an actual slot machine. Um, so we have the cartridge for this one. This is by David Crane. Uh, this one is a joystick. <laughs> Texas Hold'em I know how to play. There you go. Let's start it off. Now we're playing the right one. Uh, let's start that again. Uh, this is March 15th, 1979, uh, also called Slots. No. Other one, maybe? No, this is... Well, it could be, I guess. Oh, yeah. Where do you have to press start? Joystick number two. Oh, David. Why did you make a joystick number two? <laughs> like on the Commodore 64. You have to play with joystick number two. Because for some reason, joystick number one on the Commodore 64 put, made characters on the screen. So we've got a 19 and a 21 and a 4 and a 1. So you just put in two coins? Yeah. So where's the line? Is it in the middle? I Is don't the matching? know. Usually that's how it works. Okay. Or is it the bottom? So the button puts in coins. And then you pull Five the, is the, put the handle. Nothing. And that's how many how much money you have at the top at left, right? which is nothing. This is why you don't play slots. Because <laughs> you lose. You have two coins left. Oh. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> Atari got on a gambling kick. No kidding. One bet per line. Three lines go across. Two diagonals. So bet five for all five. Oh, I, I mean, it, it would be nice if they showed the lines like they would. Yeah, it is very realistic. <laughs> Where you just lose all your money. Yeah. Oh, and my money's all gone. <laughs> and it's gone. Oh, and it's gone. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, we, we won a tiny bit of money. No, a ton. Did we? 44. We won 44. Very oh, nice. Oh, that's what you could win, is in the top left. I don't know what that is. No, it goes up. Spend way too much time in casinos, Dave says. Time to quit. Yeah, now it would be time to quit. If you're actually playing. Yeah. The cats are out of control. They're too full of treats. Oh. 
No, no treat times. They got into the treats upstairs. Oh. 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 Oh, nothing. Oh. <gasps> nothing. Were they not lined Diagonal. up? Diagonal. Mm. Has to be straight across the middle, I guess. One bet per line. Three lines go across. Two diagonal. That's a line across. I did not win anything. Oh, so bet five for all lines. Oh, I always bet five for all oh, lines. Okay. That's what I've been doing. What, what the? the? Yeah, I yeah, agree. Exactly. <laughs> Maybe it is just through the middle. Could be. Because when you won, it was in did the I middle. Did I win something there? No, I don't think so. Totally rigged. I agree, Charles. <laughs> all these games are rigged. <gasps> it's hilarious. Oh, three lines, nothing. A car. I do like the And there's car. no wild cards. Well, maybe the car's a wild No, I don't think the car's a wild card. It's probably the... Uh... Car, line, nothing. It might be the game variation. It could be, yes. It, this might be just the middle line. Maybe. That's not a very exciting uh, <laughs> variation. slot variation. See, that, See would, that, that should hit. But not in this variation, I'm guessing. Everyone's or maybe money. it is just straight through Car, the Car, nothing. Funny. It's just, this just lose your money. <laughs> it's a game call. Oh, two uh, cars. Meow. There are other symbols and other variations. Okay. Oh. There's a fun yeah. one. TV! TV! Oh, big payout! From what? Cash out. <laughs> I don't know. I bet, I bet the, um, the manual's great for this game. Yeah. It probably explains everything. Cash out now! <laughs> yes. It's a shame. It's, uh... Oh, car? Oh, oh. Bell. Um, Let's see how people get addicted, though. Yeah, just one more try. Just one more. I know the next one's going to hit. This has got to be the most boring Twitch live stream, watching someone play <laughs> slots. I suppose if they win, it's very exciting. Yeah. Maybe there's Twitch channels just dedicated to slot machines. Oh, I bet there is. Do you think? Do they let... Do they like somebody with a home slot machine? Maybe. They wouldn't no. let someone in a casino. Oh, uh, no. Oh, two. Where did you get the two? Because I've seen you match two before and yeah. it didn't do anything. It probably has to be two from... Certain things. Okay. Thank God for the five-minute timer. Yes. Yeah, exactly. Teaches kids how to gamble. Hey, look, I just won big. Oh, massive. Good way to end it. Big money! Cash out! Which we will be doing. Oh my goodness, I ran out to tones. <laughs> nice. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Tanya's buying Big everyone money. dinner. <laughs> Just keeps going. You have to rubber wrap on the screen too. Big money! Wow! Exactly! Right at the very end, just as the timer timer ran out and he pulled out the cart <laughs> yeah. oh, you saw the end so this is superman or it should be Let's see if it works nice no 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 high pitch wine yay superman okay Go for it. You, you want to try this one? I played all the slots last sure. time. Sure. Right? This is by John Dunn. And I believe this is the first licensed superhero game. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Oh no, the bridge you know got game? blown up. Barely. You have to turn into Superman, get all the bridge pieces. Uh, so that the bridge is back together or something. <laughs> is it uh, like a... It's not a puzzle, but like um, a maze. Uh, you have to find things. It's a really crazy looking game, but it's supposed to be decent. Are you finding puzzle pieces? What's going on here? Ah, oh, I'm rescuing somebody. Here, you go there. <laughs> I, I've never played Superman before. I've seen people play it. Oh, that's a bridge piece. I need to fly that back. Turn into Superman again. Oh, I have to get 
I have to find, uh... Oh! There we go. Give it the branch piece. Oh, I've got it! Fly back. Pray oh, there's another one! friend's house. Okay. Fun. Four-line kernel, I think. Oh, God. Mm. First great speedrun game. That bridge? Music. Yep. Except I ran into something. Where's Is the... that kryptonite? Maybe. Floating in the air. Oh, there's the other bridge piece. Damn it. Oh, I dropped it. Come on, pick it up again. Where is the bridge? There it is. Oh, what the? <laughs> There's up and down and... So if you go down and then you go back up, you're not in the same place again. Oh, no. So what to... is this craziness? This There's is a crazy. helicopter. There's a guy with a gyrocopter. Yeah. Personal gyrocopter. Capture the crooks, take to the take them to the jail, rebuild the bridge, then go to the daily oh, planet. Is that why I'm doing it Thanks, wrong? Thanks, Dave. Dave knows knows what's happening with Dave these games. Knows Superman. <laughs> okay, I've got the dude. I'll take him to the jail. That's not the jail. Where's the jail? Come on, jail. There's the jail. Good job. I'll stick near the jail. There's a bad guy. Okay, you go to the jail. <laughs> you go to the jail. Everyone goes to the jail. <laughs> Everyone goes to jail. Oh. Kryptonite. Oh no, kryptonite! Oh, oh no! Come on. I need the... I don't know what I need. Woman? Oh, she gives me back my powers. Does she? Okay, you go there. Oh no! Oh, yep! You lost your guy. Where'd he go? Come here. Guy. Oh, there he is. He's right by the jail. How convenient. <laughs> so how many more guys do I have to get? Oh, there's two more here. Drop it. Drop Drop the piece. Drop it. Bring it back? Oh! Oh, stop it! I'm gonna drop the piece. There. And he's back here. But he's right by the kryptonite, I'm guessing, because I turn into a walking Superman. But she renews my power. That's interesting. That was fun. Yeah. Stick by the jail. Oh, perfect. Bad guy. Check for the kryptonite. Oh, not the bad guy. Oh, no. Come here, bad guy. Bars in upper left represent the remaining crooks. Upper left. Okay, so I have like two-ish. Oh, uh, Where's the jail? Okay, that's enough for that one. <laughs> that's interesting. It is really different. I think, again, it's having a manual would help one. Yeah. There we go. You're in jail. I, I really want to get these last. Oh, give me back my power. Put her down. I think there's one more guy left. No, maybe two? Because there's no, two no. more bars? No, that bar might be uh, the, oh, the bridge pieces. I don't know. Oh, yep. Yeah. Got the gyrocopter dude. Damn it. <laughs> Thank you. Wow, and also, yikes, I need drama need. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. Crazy. That kryptonite. I assume it's kryptonite. Yeah, well, it turns me into a walking Superman every time, so... Yeah. Is Lex Luthor in here somewhere? I haven't seen him. No. Oh, bridge piece! Stop it! He... Okay. It's gotta fly at a certain level, I think, so I can pick up bridge pieces. Above the... Come on, bad guy. There's one more flying dude. Going too low. Can we go down? No. Yep. There he is. I need to drop this. There. Ah. Where did he go? He's around here somewhere. Fine guys. Where are you? <laughs> Jarcopter guy is Lex Luthor. Oh, it is Lex oh. Luthor. There you well, go. He is hard to get. Green woman is Lois Lane. That's kind of what I figured. Yeah. Kind of pops up here and there. No, no, no. Come on, guy. Bridge piece? Can you drop it by the bridge or not? Oh, I just stopped flying and then it dropped it. Okay. Oh. Sorry, I'm spending a little bit more time on this. I, I kind of like it. 
It is neat. Yeah. I like the scrolling screens and the different environments. It's a and... multi-screen game. It, it's... This is a... Oh, there he is. There he is. Get him. Oh, got him. Okay. Be very careful. Fly very high. Oh, there's a good tank. Switch screens. There's the jail. Come on, dude. Oh, that's fine. No. Use button to look at screens next to you? Oh, okay, cool. Ah, ran right. Oh, there he is. Lois Lane, help me. Thank you. Okay, go away. Where'd he go? Oh, God. That's actually really good. Thank you. Where is it? Or maybe you don't deliver Lex Luthor. Where do you put Lex Luthor? You put him in the jail. I can't seem to find the jail anymore. Oh, there it is. You got okay, it. now I get the bridge pieces. <laughs> We're gonna bridge. be here till midnight. <laughs> there's the bridge. Oh, was there one? No, no, there's the bridge. There's oh, the yeah, spot. Yeah. yeah. So if I stick around here. Oh, there's one. Where is it? Up. Oh. It's down. Superhero franchise game. Yep. Uh, not surprised that Superman. Yeah, Superman. Great movie. Very popular. Very, yep. Great movie. Great movie. At least the first one. The other ones, eh. Yeah. First one. First one is excellent. There. As soon as I find one thing, i am like, oh, there's the jail ten times over now. Yeah. When I don't need it. There it is. How do you do it? That didn't work at all. That's not where it's supposed to be. Okay, press the button. Twice over. Twice over. Done. Done. Come on. Okay. Be here all night. I, I did we put can go the bad, back and play this sometime. I did put the bad guys in jail. Yes, you that did. That bridge piece is not going in place. I don't know. I don't know how it works. <laughs> but it's cool. It's very cool. Just leave it there. Just leave it there. <laughs> <laughs> just leave it. It'll rebuild itself. You're not you're not a builder, you're just flying pieces. Yeah. Okay, next do you know how to play backgammon? No. Oh boy. No. Okay, we're gonna look at backgammon. I, it's not a game I've really played much of, so it was like chess or checkers, yes, but backgammon. I, I know you move I, I played... move roll dice and move stuff along, but that's yeah. all I know. And there are like certain rules for certain dice rolls. Mm, mm. You can like double up things, and it's been like 30 years since I played backgammon. Where is it? Oh, that's it. My dad had a backgammon set, and I don't think I ever learned how to play it. Yeah, we had a nice one and played it a bit. Oh, that's very detailed. It's nice. Oh, colors. Okay. Do you recall? Not at all. Okay. What? I get to choose the dice? And then... Oh, let's just reset that. Probably won't be playing for five minutes, actually. Okay. And then it's this person's. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you just... You do that one. I don't want to switch back and forth. I'm rolling the dice. So I am pink. So I guess I'm, like, moving the pink ones. Oh, this is really detailed. Wow. Let's move it there. I don't understand. Let's move that one there. It's like you can move two. Like I'm moving two. Oh, okay. Or I can move six, and like you're safe by moving. I can move six twos or what? two sixes. Like I can move two six times. Like I moved like four. Okay. Uh, and then I can move like one, two, three, four, 
five, six. I think it's like that. And then I can do that. I don't know. And then I go here because I'm finished or it's something like that. It's it's a game that only people who are now 70 or 80 can play. <laughs> I'm sure people still play it, but it's just been so long. Thanks, Dave, for joining us and, oh, and helping us out with these games. You we're have... on the second to last game. Yeah. We're almost done. <laughs> yes. But yeah, We'll have thanks. another one soon. We'll, we'll be uh, moving on from 79 to 1980. 1980, when it goes boom, and Activision comes in. Yeah. Okay, I'm just like moving things now. Yeah. I don't. I don't. We don't know how to play this. We don't know how to play But it's very visually impressive. Yes. Like incredibly visually it looks impressive. looks like a beautiful backgammon board. And the last one is chess. Yay! Which video we chess. Barely know how to play. I know how to play. Oh, perfect. I'm not a good player, so but I know how to play it. This one is, uh, well, Superman was September 28th, 1979. Uh, backgammon, October 14th, 1979. And the next one, video chess, is November 18th, 1979. These cats are going insane. What is up with you two? <laughs> what are you doing? The last one is a joystick. All right. Oops, sorry. A little bit of chess. Don't expect much. <laughs> no. It's been a long time. Oh! This is the game that was advertised on the box with the heavy sixer and was not delivered this with one. the heavy sixer. So they were sued and the person who sued them won because they were doing false advertising. Well, you're gray, so you'd be moving the gray ones, not the white ones. Gray? No, but the white goes first. Are you playing white? Are we playing each other? I picked two. Okay. Thanks, Packrat VG. See ya. Why would I See be you next going time. first? Good I don't night. know. It's gray. No, it's white. White always goes well, first. It's not white, so please move. Because it's Gray's turn. But it's a Gray X. Weird. Why is it a Gray X? Whoa! Oh, it's one player. It's thinking. Oh, that's what it is. <laughs> Why isn't it two player? Oh, no, can... it is. It's one player. You can play the computer then. I haven't played this in so long. I don't even know what the strategy is anymore. Why wouldn't they use a white X? Oh, so it doesn't blend in, I guess. That's confusing. I don't know strategy anymore. Move the little horsey. I know. I just, I just, it's been so friggin' long since I've played. I think it's on a low level because it's not taking very long to think about it. It's been so long. I think on the highest level, it takes like ten minutes to think about the move. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, Charles Whelan says five minutes will be like two moves. On the highest level, that's for sure. Get those horses out. That work? Oh. Did it work? There we go. Oh, there we go. Amazing program to yeah. make this even work. Oh, yes. Have a good night, Packrat. Just the amount of the good use of memory. Mm -hmm. Like, it only has 128 bytes to, like, do moves and calculate moves to a certain depth. And there's hardly any depth that you could go to with 128 bytes. Because I don't think there's any RAM on board the cartridges at this point. That's okay. We'll either see you win or see you lose. <laughs> it's only five minutes, so I don't have to do it to the end. <laughs> no. You get to see the pretty colors. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, interesting. Take his pawn. Take it. <laughs> oh, you can use the horse to get the pawn, or you use the pawn to get the pawn. The pawn to get the pawn. Uh... 
Because not only like that. is this hard to calculate moves, this was even brilliant on how they displayed the board mm -hmm. with eight characters across when you only have two player characters. But they obviously thought they could do it in 1977 and they must have been able to think about making this far enough ahead because they did put chess on the box when they made the box. Even the look of the characters is, is they're all recognizable, right? Mm-hmm. I don't know what I'm doing, so it's okay. As long as you can move the pieces. I know I know how they move. I my dad used to have this set. It was a physical set, but it had a computer built in. It was a Kas Kasparov was the famous chess player. Yeah. And you would push the pieces in and um, move them. So it would know what you moved by pushing them in, right? Yeah, you push it in and, and move it, and it had like 10 levels, and I, I played that. And that was really fun, because you would kind of start easy, and then it would, wouldn't would take long to think, and you could beat it. And I could beat it like maybe maybe to level 5 or 6. but It, it would tell it you what a... the pieces that it wanted you to move for him. For yes, the, for the you'd opponent. move it for him, and then you move, well, for the, computer, for the computer, and then you'd move it. <laughs> it was really cool, actually, because it was a physical chess set. Yeah. Then there's ones with the magnets that move the pieces itself. Yeah. And then it moves it, which is pretty cool. Hi. What are you doing upstairs? What are you and the other cat? You're going crazy. They got into the pill pockets. Oh, of course they did. Come here. Don't squeak. Just come. Hi. You calm down a bit now? Got all the crazies out? Is it th thinking? I'm thinking. Oh. oh, I see where the X is. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to make a move because I'm not going to think about this too much. <laughs> this doesn't look like it's a timed one. No, thank God. <laughs> wonder if there's timed variations on this. I like the flashing colors. <laughs> Yeah, it's better than like a black screen. Does all that flashing represent the player's migraine? It's like, oh. Yeah, uh, pretty much. Oh, look at that Atari processing away. Brr, it's getting Thinking warm. Into the future. Oh, you're checkmate or check? I'm in, oh, I'm in check. I'm in check. Oh, check. Not checkmate. No, because you can still move. Yeah, I can still move this, dude. I'm sure this is... Not the greatest move, but that's okay. Like, how could it do all the calculations with 128 bytes while also memorizing what's on the board, too, and all those positions? Oh, thank God. <laughs> you won, stalemate. <laughs> I don't want to. I I I I'm, I live in fear that Erlen's going to see this and be like, "Oh my God, why does she do it?" Why? <laughs> There we go. We've completed 1977 to 1979. There we go. Fairly basic games, but some of them are more advanced, like the chess. It's getting into more advanced games. Um, what was your favorite out Ooh, of those? Ooh, out of all of them. Yes. Because I think we'll do that each time. We'll think about, oh, what did Ooh, we like playing? From this set of yeah. games. Um... I'd like to play more Flag Capture. That was fun. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, what would you like to play again? What would that... What would I play again? Um, That's probably the better question. I did not do too badly at that... Um, Thank you, Charles Reese. What was the sound one again? Uh, it was the early sound? on. The memorization? Surround? No. Um, the memorization one. Brain games? Yeah. Where it was like, doo, 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 yeah. doo, doo. you you like that one? Well, I did well at it. at it. Yeah. Sometimes you just feel good because you're like, hey, that didn't go. I, I hit 19. That was 
way further than I thought I would. That was really excessively good. I was like, <laughs> wow, I wasn't expecting that. Bowling was wonderful. Bowling's amazing. Bowling's a wonderful game. Breakout as well. I'm, I'm terrible at Breakout, but that yeah, was good too. Charles more, Whelan brought that up. That's a really up. good action game, yeah. the Breakout. What about the people in the chat? Yes, like, what uh, was your favorite? Charles obviously really liked Breakout, but I'm curious. Yep. I liked Flag Capture. Flag Capture bowling, was pretty skydiver. awesome. Bowling, Skydiver. Skydiver, yeah. I don't think I'd play it for very long again, but it was very good. Uh, an, a surprise uh, was the human cannonball uh, mm. made by Unknown. <laughs> um, I, I was like, this is this looks terrible, but actually, yeah. it's challenging. It's, <laughs> it's a challenging, challenging game. Um, but bowling was bowling. I think for classic games, I think bowling is awesome. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, human cannonball, <laughs> unknown. Would, yeah. You said uh, that, right? Codebreaker was unknown, too. Uh, Who was Human yes. Cannonball? Yeah, unknown. Unknown. Yeah. Also known as Cannonball. Bowling, Breakout, yep. Oh, thank you, Repentless VG. Yes. Glad you uh, enjoyed the show. Um, we'll be doing... I, I'm pretty sure 1980 will be divided up into two episodes. Because that's when Activision come in, comes into play. Yes. And that's where... Tons in the tons 1980s. Tons of games come out in 1980. Yeah. Um, because a lot... Uh, Space Invaders comes out oh, and wow. I, some really classic games nice. are coming out in 1980. Oh, that'll be fun. So I think probably two, at least two episodes. Be split? Yeah. Probably just two. I haven't looked at how many. Mm. Um, you like Superman. You wanted to play more of that. Yeah, I've never really played it because I didn't have the instructions. So I was like, oh, we fly around and... But of happens. all of these games from these three years, mm -hmm. Superman felt like it had more to it the than depth. just just, oh, here's a little almost like a board game or a little game and here are a bunch of variations it was multi-screen multi-screen which is huge and and you had to do different things yep it, it wasn't the same thing over and over again it, it, it had it like a narrative to it almost yep. yeah multiple enemies that's um, really so that cool. was a huge progression yeah uh that was outlaw the cowboy oh that one was good too outlaw was excellent yep there's a lot of variations with the things moving the yeah. target practice Really fun playing it against someone, right? Yes, yeah. I mean, any of the two-player head-to-head games were always fun. Yeah. Um, the Indy 500 was pretty good. I oh, yeah, I liked the variation where it was tag with the cars. That was a lot of fun. Yes, yeah. Where it was one person was it, then the other person you had to drive around. and Really good um, paddle game. Yeah, yeah. very, very good. Yeah. Driving. Driving it. Driving controller. Oh, driving. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. not paddle. But driving controller, yeah. Um, yeah. yeah, so there was some, there's some standouts in the first three years. Um, some yeah. really good ones that you can, that you can still get, um, for very, they're all super cheap. Like any of these on this list, oh, there's yeah. so many copies of all these games. So I don't think any of these are rare. No, um, no. Some variations would be rare. Yeah. Um, so, uh, we have some cool stuff coming up. Uh, we have the exclusive world premiere of Orbital. Oh. War from Leandro Camara. Nice. The person who did ZPH the game. Nice. And Zark Stars. Yeah. Uh, there's also a very cool game called Refractor that just was put out today. Okay. And it's it's like air hockey with lasers. You laser the ball to the other person's goal and the other person has a laser to push it. Mm. Super cool concept. It was just uh, started today. Um, so by Friday, maybe there'll be an update because there's no score or anything, but you don't need score. It's all functional. It is two player, uh, head to head. And we'll add another one, uh, tomorrow there's no show because I had to get this ready. Busy week. Um, but there's a show on Friday. It'll be with Darcy. Mm -hmm. Most likely it's scheduled for noon. Mm -hmm. Um, and we'll probably do an after dark after that, maybe with Darcy. Nice. Just to switch it up. Nice. That's most likely, and that'll give me some time to prepare the 1980 part one. Part one. Yeah. Cool. Um, then at the end of the month, we're going to do Pressure Gauge for the 2600 High Score Showdown Season 6, and I think also the Harmony Homebrew um, uh, High Scores is going to be ending by then, so okay. we'll see who comes out on top on that, see where you place, see where I place. See where Charles Whelan places? Yes. Um, <laughs> Very high. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he did really well. Yeah. 
Um, and there's some other big games coming up as well. Mm. Um, oh, and also today, I don't really do news on After Dark, but uh, Atari Age released, because it's not till Friday we do a normal show. Yeah. Atari Age released the list of games that are... Let me just show you. Actually, there's a little story with that too. Um, let me just get that thread. Where is it? <laughs> um, so, Atari, uh, Atari Age released the games that are going to be released at Portland Retro Gaming Expo. Mm. Um, here they are. It's, it's just crazy number of games. Uh, for the 2600 blocks, Gorf Arcade, Grizzards, Load Runner 2600, Ruby Q, Stratavox, Vroom. Um, oh, wow. For the Atari 5200 8 bit, AWA Anthology. Remember when we played all those games and did the interview with oh, the yeah. three guys? That updated their games from like the 80s. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Um, so they're putting them all together in one cartridge. Oh, nice. So yeah. it's, that's, there's some really fun games in there. Excellent. Uh, Robin Banks is coming out. Um, I haven't heard of that one. Yeah, we haven't played 5, it on the 5200 because okay. I haven't upgraded my 5200. Yeah, yeah. Yet. Okay. Uh, for 7800, some heavy hitters. 2048, Attack of the Petsky Robots. Nice. EXO, Galaxian Arcade, Keystone Coppers, which you played the other day. Oh, so good. Uh, Pac Man Collection, 40th anniversary, wow. Slide Boy, and Maze Land, Unawar S. Uh, for our Atari Jaguar, Gods nice. and Chaos Engine, we'll be playing those very soon on the show. Mm -hmm. um, also, Kicks. For the 2600, Boulder Dash reissue for the 2600, and Popeye for the Atari nice. 7800. Nice. Um, so what I did is I saw that, and I, I was like, oh, I'll put that together in a in a graphic, and so I made a graphic of it, right? Oh, nice. And I said, oh, okay, for the 2600, I grouped them all together, 7800, 5200, Char Jaguar. I posted it on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter. And then, let's see. And then, to my surprise, let's just see. Oh. What does Portland Retro Gaming Expo do? Oh. Portland Retro nice. Gaming Expo posted it, not even retweeted it, posted yeah. my image. Nice. I don't know if they thought it was an official Atari thing age. from Atari That's Age, okay. <laughs> but uh, they posted my my uh, graphic. Nice. Because uh, it looks nice. It's kind of lasery. And yeah. So it organized nicely, but uh, very nice. Yeah, so that's up on the Portland Retro Gaming Expo, all of Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Awesome. So that was a lot of fun. Um, <laughs> so we have lots of stuff coming up. Uh, we'll probably might do another Atari Age Day with all these releases or might some of well. these releases. I think I'd break it into two episodes actually. Excuse me. Yeah. Because that's a lot to do in one yeah. day. That's insane. <laughs> that's bigger than the last one and the last one was big. Yeah. Um, but we'll see. We'll be there to, at uh, Portland Retro Gaming Expo doing interviews and maybe love some live streaming. We'll see how good the connection is really. <laughs> that, that, that is the last time it was great limiting factor. Eh, it was okay. Um, so we'll be back on Friday with Darcy with some more cool games and probably some more. Well, we'll definitely be doing like this mm -hmm. twice a week on After Dark, uh, going through all the Atari 2600 a games. Lot of games to get through. 450, and we've got how many? 25 down? 25 down. <laughs> Woo! Much more. Well, all right. Very cool to see the games in rapid succession. Uh, good to see all the. A start of the art developed even yeah. if you are taking breaks for stuff like sleep and life whatnot good show yeah yeah we're Thank not you. doing them all in a row oh and i want a lot <laughs> i wanted to do them in order yeah because you see the progression you see oh now they've got multicolor enemies yeah oh they're doing multi things per line oh they're using playfield now they're flashing doing yeah, interlacing you stuff. Kind of slowly see it build up. Yeah, yeah. So it'll be it'll be cool, and then we'll next episode we'll see third party most likely. Yeah. Maybe not. We'll see. Okay. Third party people like Activision start yeah. to make start games. to take make games. Yeah. Yeah. More than just Pong. 
More than just more than just punk. Yeah. Okay, we're out of here. Thanks right. for tuning in, Charles Whelan, Chalcedony Mao, uh, Robocat twenty eighty four. <laughs> Uh, Charles Reese, uh, Repentless VG, Charles uh, uh, Whelan, uh, Pack RVG, uh, Dave M, Arizona, I'm guessing. Yep, he said. <laughs> uh, that's pretty much Arizona. Yep. Uh, uh, Gato Zerma, something to do with cats. <laughs> uh, and, yeah, Robocat as well. Uh, Colonel Lama. Yes. Uh, Lord Monkus. Lord Monkus, that's a name I haven't seen in a while. Uh, Pro KFL, I'm guessing. Um, who else? Anybody else? Oh, Sunfall oh. T at the top there. Sunfall T E. Thank Excellent. you all Thank for you tuning so much. in. It yep. was a fun show. It's oh, fun so to, much fun! And it's a great excuse to play all the games oh, that I've never games. played yeah. before, and uh, find some gems that yeah. didn't even know. Try about. some games. You're going. This looks ridiculous. Oh, this is really fun. This is actually fun. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, well, we'll see you on Friday yes. or maybe sooner. We'll see, but probably Friday. Yeah. Okay, bye everyone. Have a good, Have night. A good night. Have a good week.